Hello. You did it. I did it, well yes. Done. The timer was a little bit off. You said hello slightly before the scene swapped. Yeah, I know. I did it. I did it for the. It was like a teaser. What was to come? And then I pressed the scene thing, and then just that's, like, how you, that's how you get them in. Get the punters through the door. That's right. Just saying hello. <laughs> hello. Hey, everybody. I was. I was gonna say hello. Hello, everybody. Hope you're doing well. Um, this is another sneaky stream of Subnautica because. Oh. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'm just gonna turn my phone. Unprofessional. <laughs> gonna put that on flight mode there. Oh my god. We're off to a great start. Ruins the stream already. Mm. Sorry everyone. <laughs> Just gonna shut the stream down now. Uh, hey there, Dank Picard. Um, submarine mode? It's a joke about flight mode. Oh. <laughs> That's very good. We're gonna play some more Subnautica, which is a game that culminates all of my, all of my deepest nightmares that I never talk about because they're too frightening. But uh, this game has managed to break into my skull and um, have it all laid out on screen, so. What the hell are you talking about? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it all went off the rails a bit there, didn't it? Yeah, well. Okay, so where we were last time, we discovered how to make plants. I don't like how much that plant is moving. It makes me uncomfortable. Um, and we learned how to make a vending machine that gives us dehydrating crisps. We made this base all by ourselves, which I'm very proud of. And we're storing all of our eggs in a thing called Ergs. Oh, we got a radio thing, just in time. We finished off with a radio message and we got another one, huh? This is Life Pod 4. Oh. We've landed close to the Aurora. Flotation Sounds like Bear Grylls. Active, but we've got some big old fish in the water with us. I don't know how long big old last. fish in the water? We're close to the crash site, so bring radiation protection. Four out. Signal coordinates corrected. All right, I guess we're going to go after uh, Ocean Man Bear Grylls. Oh, not in the dark. You talk about your fears all the time, that's why we suggested Subnautica. <laughs> yes, that's a good point. So, I think having the... You should have the mobile vehicle bay fragments by now, is what I reckon. And I can't remember where they spawn, but we should do some exploration and try and find them. Yeah. Wait. Data downloads, codes and clues. A distress signal has been received from Life Pod 4, but the attached coordinates were corrupted. Last available photographic data has been downloaded and analyzed. Flotation device is active. Life Pod located at sea level. That's us! No, it's not. Look at where the position of the ship is. It's closer to the ship than you are. Oh. Pod is in close proximity to radioactive fallout from the Aurora. Well, they're dead. Transmission origin approximately 150 meters northwest of the Aurora's port midsection. That means nothing to me. So Well, you can see where the ship is now. Yes. And you can work out relatively where that life pod is in relation to you. It's there. Well, it was more sort of to the left. It wasn't right alongside it, was it? So no. I don't, like, you know, over that way. Well, I can't see it. Well, because it could be... You know, that ship is a few kilometers away from you. Is it? Yeah. But it's sort of well, it's because it's a huge spaceship. Ah. Okay, so we're trying to find it. Shut up. We're trying to find... Oh, look at the little Gary fish going around in a circle. It's so sweet. It's doing a little dance with the boomerang fish. Is it dead? Oh, is that the one that I cooked and then threw away immediately? No? no well, free meal. But it's... That's so sweet! Is it sleeping, maybe? Maybe that's... Oh! Oh! It, it, it was like, hey, wake up! You're about to be eaten! I'm still catching up on the other streams, but I'm glad I stayed up to watch the shenanigans, shenanigans happen live for an hour or so. Yes, welcome! Um, this is basically what happens in the streams. I just look at fish. No, I'm gonna leave that one because it did a nice performance for us and I... I am a patron of the arts.
<laughs> we'll take that acid mushroom there. Okay. Um, what we were looking for is mobile vehicle bay fragments. Bay fragments. Really just look for pieces of the aurora and there will be things to scan. Look for pieces of the aurora. Pieces of the aurora. Which will probably not be in here. How many times are you going to go into that exact cave and then get spooked by the thing that's always there? What's going on there? Oh wow, is it being attacked? Why is it so upset? Something up. Ah, it's coming this way! Oh, that eyeball emote is terrifying. Kelp forest should have. I was going to recommend looking around the kelp forests because we kind of skipped uh. over those in order to look around the red zone. But the the kelp yeah. forests, we never really did much exploration, did we? It's true, but then it's dark at the moment, and you said that the enemies are more vicious at dark, and that one's got a thing with great big giant pointy teeth. Well, don't go out till it's light then. Is there any way to like nap until it's daylight? Ah! You can build a bed, but you don't have access to a bed. Yeah, you need to scan one, I think. Oh, okay. You may, have, you may have access to a bed, I'm not sure. Well, what I might do then is I'll continue bringing stuff down into my base. Although, the sun's is... coming up now. Oh. So you're good to go. Yay! Going on an adventure. Do we have... Do I have a battery? Yes. There's lots of kelp forests very nearby, so you'll probably be able... Like, you can look around those. Okay. Ooh! Sea glide fragment. Oh, we've already got one. It's there was one right near to though. our ship. This whole time. The current objective is to get like a vehicle bay thing so we can make vehicles. And the vehicles will apparently protect us from some of the bigger fish. And then once we have protection from the bigger fish, then we can go deeper into the depths. More titanium. So you want to actually be in the kelp forest. Mm -hmm. You're kind of just... I'm too one. scared to be in the kelp forest. They're less scary than that. You're faster than the enemies. Oh. You just need to do exactly what you just did. Oh, there there's go. a mobile vehicle bay fragment. Okay, so they're going to be in boxes too, apparently. They might be. Sometimes things just spawn around wrecks and so on, but you should yeah. look for those boxes, yeah. 30 seconds. Oh. That's a good start, you found one already. Whew. Yeah, sorry everyone. Uh, I recently turned my microphone up because I'm rather soft-spoken um, on streams. Uh, and Cav is quite a bit louder than I am. I mean, it's... Ooh. New creature discovered. It's all about context. Scared. So if you've got, like, when you scream, it does push the microphone over the top. Yeah, okay, well, I'll keep that in mind when I'm facing sheer terror. Okay. Hello. Oh, thank you for following Bat Plastic. I'm gonna steal all their stuff. <laughs> and get some of that. No, you're not. You didn't pick it up, you just oh. smashed the rock. You do that a lot. Okay, let's have a Hi. Ooh! Hello! Thank you! Bad at video games! Oh my goodness! Kindred spirit! Apropos. Welcome. Your inventory's full. Inventory. No, your inventory's full of titanium. So there's no point. 
do an inventory management. Right. I mean, really, right now, you should just go back and put all that titanium that's, in the box. That's what I'm doing! Jeez! And Backseat stop gaming. picking it up. <laughs> no! Whee! Oh, that was fun. I'll try not to backseat today. Sorry. No, it's okay. You're allowed to do that. Oh! <laughs> oh. You like the peeper? Yeah. That is not a roof. I should put the roof there. Actually, no, this is where all my storage is, so... Well, you can put another multi-purpose room on top of that room and build a ladder between them. This one? On top of this room? No, on top of the other one. They can stack oh. the multi-purpose rooms. Why don't I try doing that now? Well, because you don't have the titanium on you. I have so much titanium! But you haven't broken it down from the scrap into titanium But I've got yet. lots of regular titanium as well. I mean, I can put it on there. Lower down. There. That's cool. And then I go down the hatch and I make all this stuff. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hey, Kaifu1! Welcome, welcome. When you were living in Australia, did you ever go to Underwater World? No, but that sounds awful. Uh, what is it? Why can't I turn? Oh, it's because I've. Okay. It sounds like, is it an aquarium? I remember there was a place in Queensland called like Wet n Wild or something, which as an adult that has weird connotations. But... Why? I don't get it. It's all right, I'll tell you when you're grown up. All right, whoops. Yay! So do you see the space hole strength in the top left? The space hole hole strength? Every time you put a new piece on the base, you get a little update about its hole strength. Oh. Like every new bit you put on lowers the strength, except uh, unless you put on reinforcement. Okay, so smaller is better for the time being. Yeah, although it is uh, completely fine. Like, you're in the shallows right now, so it's not so bad. Hmm. You could put that hatch on the side. I don't want to on it on top. I don't think it goes on top. Oh. Because stuff can What a rotter. But yeah, you could put it on one of the sides around here, so you've got two entrances. That might be cool. But you need quartz. Oh. Well, I'll keep that there and then I'll get back to it when I can be bothered. Actually, this is a long way off, so maybe I will get that. I'll get some quartz. I'll get some quartz now. You need a dedicated titanium box. Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. Should make one. But then I use up the quartz that I was going to use we'll to make, make a locker. Yeah, I'll make a locker. A locker. I meant like a little one. But that's fine as well. You can take another quartz. Like the little ones just take yeah, titanium. titanium. Alright, let's do that. Hey, and I'll say... If only there were a funny way to abbreviate titanium, eh? Tight? <laughs> Tort. Eventually, I'll have I'll have buckets just for just for like all the different ores. That would be cool. It'd be like I'll have like a mineral room. You won't for silver. No. I was always struggling with silver. Really? I've found so much. Guess I'm just better than you. You got another radio message, by the way. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't care about it. Yay! And now let's go in through the hatch. See, look, now 3.5. Top left. Now you missed it again. Jeez. 
Oh shit, how do I get down? Well, you need to build a ladder to the hey there. Ah! Oh, thank you, Herkram, thank you. Welcome. Need to build a ladder. That, the grow bed is beneath that. Oh. Well, that's right in front of the stairs. Jeez, you're so fussy. That's in front of the, uh, Oh, no, that's probably okay. Yeah, it's letting me do it, so... Way! Yeah, you don't want it to be, like, in front of your corridor, do you? Because you've blocked yourself in. Yeah. Well, it let me do it. Silly. Why did it do that? Well, you should place it from down here. Well, why did I do space. that? Let's try this again, shall we? Ah! You need to look up at the piece of floor. You oh, want. there we go. Yay! There you go. Pull it. Oh, I guess tit is probably the the rude thing, right? For titanium. Yes. Yeah. You up there in the end. So don't swear on stream. You get banned. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not the one who suggested I say tit. Anyway, so we'll put all this titanium down, and maybe while we're here, I'll get some more bleach. Oh, I need something else for bleach, don't I? Coral tube sample. That's all the stuff here. No, oh, you're getting so good at the game. Yeah, because I've. It's because when I collect things, I collect a lot of it, mm -hmm. and then I end up with exactly what I need. Mmm, firm, low-fat reptilian flesh. Nothing like Consider it. Consider disguising the flavor of unsavory meats with salt or locally sourced herbs and spices. Mm. <laughs> spices. I just saw it had a really... Oh, okay, no, I wasn't looking at its mouth. I, I thought it had a really sad face. A big, big scowl. Well, I'll eat those peas. You didn't make the water. Oh, and that's kind of what I wanted to do, isn't it? You can't just drink the bleach, unfortunately. Yeah, I've heard that's not a good idea. And I could also pick my fruit! Why do I even need bleach anymore? Bleach is redundant in the new world. Yay! Well, yeah, you can eat from that if you don't have any, like, food on you. Mm. Food! Food. I'm going up here to get that. I think you can make a medical fabricator. Yeah, you can. And you've got a radio down in the base. Yeah, I know, but I'm up here already, so. Yeah. <laughs> Location uploaded to PDA. Nope. Oh, well, I guess I'll bring all this stuff down with me. Can I take everything? No. You need to do two trips. Repair tool. Don't really need that. No, you want to keep that on you. Really? Yeah. As in, in my hand at all times? No, just keep keep all every tool you make. Keep it in your inventory. As in, in, as in, in my, among my tools at my disposal at any time. Yeah. In. Okay. Yeah. And you know, I should get um a a beaker or whatever beacon. A beaker. <laughs> yeah, that way you could drink fluids, couldn't you? Yes. Egg. Beaker. And more egg. Put that poster on the wall so it's not taking up a slot in your inventory. No. We're just gonna carry it around for the whole game. Yeah. Feces. Uh, okay, I'll put the poster in the feces section. Put that down. 
any other tools? No. Open this one, put these in. This material. And what else? This. Oh, I filled it up. How big is the rebreather? The re rebreather is that big, four. Yeah, but I figure I kind of need to have that on me, right? If you're going to be doing deeper dives, yeah. Mm. Once you start using vehicles, you'll want to keep the repair tool with you. Some of the tools you can leave behind most of the time, but repair tool is pretty essential. Oh, okay. I guess uh, I'd better get on that then, huh? I don't even know why I made that section up there. I don't even need it yet. I've got plenty oh, of space. There you go. I like how you've got two big spacious rooms and you're kind of living out of a corridor attached to them. Yeah, I, I could probably, like, move them into there, but... Go find the mobile vehicle brain. Thank you. Right. Okay, I will. Also, you swim faster without the habitat builder in your hand. Useless thing. There you go. Mm! <laughs> Why are you picking... You've got a box... <laughs> Sorry everyone about that. Cav's squeaking actually makes this scarier. I'm sorry. Yeah, when Sean plays it, it's like, oh, this game is fine. What's that noise? And it's getting dark again. Oh, it's doing scary music. Oh, okay. Um What are you looking for? I'm looking for mobile car parts. Mobile vehicle bay. And where are they? They're in boxes. Where are the boxes? The boxes are in this area. Yeah, so stay in this area. But it's frightening and I don't <laughs> like it. Exchange power source. Here. Yay! Okay. Unless you're planning to go to the Aurora, you can leave the radiation helmet at the base for now. You reckon? Well, you're quite close to the radiation zone, actually, so it might be okay to keep it on you. Yeah. What? I did exchange the power source. Yeah, you, for a battery that had 2% in it. Oh. Why did I do that? Well, because you didn't read the charge. <laughs> um. Um. I was in the middle of saying something that explained myself in some way. You have a box full of titanium. Yeah. You don't need to keep you don't need to keep picking up titanium and stuffing. It will fill your inventory up and you won't be able to pick up anything else. It'll fill your inventory. Um sorry, I'm being insolent for no reason. Yeah. I'm, do, I'm taking it out on you because I'm frightened. And I shouldn't do that, I'm sorry. <laughs> It's okay. I know you're just trying to look out for me, and I appreciate you. Okay. Sounds so sincere. <laughs> Shut up. Ooh. Got a creature egg. Oh, I can't wait to incubate the shit out of these things! I want to find the... the alien life form... carbuncle... thing. This is the worst way to play the game, by the way. To face into the floor and go forward without looking forward. Really. Ah! Oh. Like, that's how you run into a big creature. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. By facing downwards and moving forward. Ah, don't put your hand close to me then. I'm sorry. Jesus. I'm really frightened. I'm on edge. I'm sorry. I can hear monster.
Ooh, there's something in there. Titanium, because he already scanned what was in there. Oh, okay. Ah, I can't see anything. Yeah. <laughs> you have a sort of panicked circular sort of thing that you're doing here. In that you're not actually exploring new places. A common complication for cave divers no is loss of orientation, <laughs> followed by eventual asphyxiation. That's me. No, you're mainly going in circles blindly around the one particular bit of this kelp forest. Yeah? Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, me I'm not known for my good sense of direction, so this is far for the course. Yeah, but a, a sort of random chance would have you explore elsewhere eventually. But yeah. <laughs> you're saying this is deliberate? Yeah, it seems so. <laughs> Don't be sorry for your natural reactions, says Eric. Thank you, <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, at the same time, I do. I am a very empathetic person, and I understand how <laughs> how terrifying a constant shrill shrieking in your ear can be. So there are other kelp forests than this one. If you travel across the, the shallows, you will eventually run into more kelp. Okay. Okay. It's that's, just that it's Well, dark. that's not the shallows, is it? Because you're going deeper. Ooh, so you want to right. go to where it's... Oh, I hear noise! Less deep. Less deep. So just aim past the life pod and keep going, and you'll bump into another kelp forest with more stuff okay. to scan. I need to make more batteries at some point. If you need them in a pinch, mm. you can swap them out of your tools. Like you don't need the habitat build a battery while you're out. Do you? So you mm. can take that out. Yeah, that's true. But you don't need to do that. So there's kelp there, isn't it? Mm, there is. Intriguing. Let's explore this kelp. Ah, I heard a thing! <laughs> ah! It's okay, Cap. Mm. Bye. Ah! Oh! <laughs> SCP-2345, thanks for following! Welcome. Ooh, silver. Called cap procrastinating. Ah! What was it? It was that. Hmm. Hmm. I can't see any like uh, buckets. I can. There's one on the screen right now. That one. Has it got something in it? It does. Laser cutter fragment. Oh wait, no, we've already got a laser cutter. Mm. I think you need to stay in the kelp forest. I think I need to stay in the kelp forest. Yeah. This one. Any kelp forest. You keep wandering out of them. Oh! I haven't seen this before. What? Drooping stinger. I'm assuming that I need to not Go near them. I mean, well, not be stung by them. You're a little low on oxygen to be going through a stinky jellyfish for us. I should. Pr How's my inventory going? It's pretty. It's almost full. So. Thirty seconds. I know. Oh. Yeah, remember to let your airy fill. Where's my ship? Where's my ship? It's over there. You're fine. Oh, oh okay. All right. I was very frightened. Oh, I was going to pick up a beacon before. I 
think that's the thing that I looked at before. That's the one you just checked. Yeah. So Ooh. stay in the forest and move. It's it might be better to swim steadily and only get the sea glide out if you need to run from something. What's that? It's mine now. It's another egg. You've already got one of those. Yay! It doesn't matter. I want to. I want a little army, a little creature army. I'll raise them and I'll treat them nicely. And then, oh, wow, look at that. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. I can hear some scary noises and I'm not, oh, oh, what's that? Is that scrap? No, that's something you can scan. Okay, good. It's like a big eyeball. Scanner room? What is that noise? So you're getting, again, the, the ones from the red zone. Yeah. Like the bioreactor, the laser cutter and stuff, but it's because you keep on drifting out of the, the kelp forest. Yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, geez, I'm going up very slowly. The noise is the official soundtrack. Yay! Yay! Kelp forest time. We're gonna do it this time. Searching the kelp forest for all the things that it has. waiting for you to spend 10 seconds on the very edge of the kelp forest but not quite in the zone and then swim away from away. it again. just go into it uh, it's a less to... scary zone than the red one i can't see any anything scary in the red zone except for the the cockroach fish well, yeah they're more aggressive than the stalkers and faster just like fell to the ground oh okay i did the thing again yeah like again you're just on the like you need to the, there's a biome right you need mm. to go into it mm. <laughs> like okay. go into it oh look at it <laughs> i don't like it i'm too frightened ah i can hear oh shit! <laughs> Uh oh. <laughs> oh, indeed. It's Ruby Rouge. Thank you for hosting. That was the worst. Uh, you told me they didn't come up that far. No, they do if they're chasing you. Uh, <laughs> they don't usually. Uh, <laughs> oh, 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 and I don't like this, Sean. Look, you're doing it. Mm, I don't see anything. It's like this is all just d designed to frighten me. It's like that. <coughs> There's nothing. Just, just continue looking. Big old pile of trash. Every every few every few ten meters. <laughs> well, if there's none around here, turn around and Find search. Another one. Well, there was more of that biome back there that you never looked in. Which one? The, like one the one, the one you were just side. in. Oh. Yeah. You looked around the edge of it and then swam through it, but there's the hole on the side. What? I'm trying to go down. What, what the? No! You're holding the spacebar, right? No! Oh, I think I, I think, yeah, I think my finger, my thumb was like <laughs> pressed on it. So turn right. And just head through it. Okay. It's good when you're giving me directions. Okay. Well, st stay right. Stop it. Look, if you hear a roar, a 
and you pull up the sea glide and just go forwards, it will never catch you. You're faster than it with the sea glide. Oh god, my shoulders are all tense. I need a massage now. But go forward, because you're not going up any quicker unless the sea, the sea light's pulling you, you know. Mm. You've also kind of spun around again. Did I? It all looks the same to me. How do you know where we are? I'm using the, uh... Mini-map. The radio beacons. And where your base is. So <laughs> That's a bit clever for me. They're so cute when they throw their stuff around. I just wish they would refrain from attacking me. You can also look to the right, where there's like a big open area. Mm. You've also went right close to a bunch of them and <laughs> stopped still. Like, the... Like, you went close to a big open area where you'd be able to see, but then you didn't look at it. Oh. Uh, Ravane Crawford says, By this point, getting the vehicle bay from the Aurora is probably quicker. But finding the rest of the scanner fragments in order to use that. Yeah. Huh. Why don't I do that? You could go to the Aurora. I mean... Can I get to the Aurora? Well, yeah, the thing that stops you early on is radiation, but you've got the radiation seat now. And then there's a few of the tools you might need. I thought there was a big fish that eats you. I didn't say there wasn't. Mmm. Fuck off! Um. So maybe it's worth me investing in the scanner rather than the vehicle bay port, given that this is too frightening for me. <laughs> you just need to... You're, you get very hung up on one area where you feel safe and you just circle it. Like, you need to just yes. push on and keep going. You've already looked at that one. See, like, you've just went around this one, that <laughs> tiny one, for like the last 15 minutes. You haven't moved more than like 50 meters away from So I'll just keep going straight ahead. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Try a new strategy now. <laughs> True cab gameplay. Tell sea creatures to fuck off. Seek fluid intake. Oh. Thirty seconds. Vital signs stabilizing. Oxygen. Oh, did, you, did you say something, Sean? I said oxygen. Oxygen. How did you say that? Bit weird. Just out of nowhere. I thought you'd miss the oxygen drop. Mm. So like, you're still sort of on the edge of the bat. You need to go into it. Uh, I hate it. I hate this. I hate this. Oh, go away. Oh no, there's so many of them. You're faster than they are. I'm faster than they are, but they're scarier than me. Mm. I don't know what I'm looking for. Mm. Oh, what's that? Is it fine? No, mm. yeah. okay. Mm. Resisting the temptation to just say, you're up, and then whatever you say. Thank you. Oh! Look at that, you found something. Oh, this looks frightening. So that might be worth checking out. Yeah, it might, might not. Extremely lying voice. It's as scared as you of you as you are of it. <laughs> Go away. Big poop. Oh, you came here before no. No. This was a different one. Ah Oh no, I'm not going in there. But that 
could be things to scan around the floor by it, or there could be a way to get inside it. Mm. Mm. Is that a, a hatch? Stay close to it so you know where it is. You don't lose it. Did you see that? It was just like... Yeah, I, I knew it was there before you did. I could see the edge of the screen. Oh, God. Just waiting for me. If you, if you preempt these things, you, sh you should be responsible for like, bringing the volume down. <laughs> So I can't get in here, and on the other side there's a bunch of those things. Oh god, that's going to be where the entrance is, isn't it? You can't tell because you're stuck I can't to... tell because I'm stuck to the wall because I'm really scared! No! No! But you could look at the entrance <laughs> from that side. Remember, you can see more than five feet, <laughs> so you can circle around and look at it from the other side without <laughs> bumping into the monsters. <laughs> uh, oh god! Mm, no, I can't see anything. It's all dark. Fuck off! <laughs> Sean, I can't do this. Would you like me to try and get you to Please, please. <sighs> this is a special arrangement we have for anyone who's new to this, for this particular game, given that it is a culmination of my worst fears. Um, and Sean really wanted to watch me play it. Our agreement is that I will play it as long as... You are on hand to take over as I need it. What the? F See, they're not so bad. Why I just don't know where the entrance you? is. Someone has asked you want to know where the entrance is. Yes, please. Is it, is it possible? It's like like you come up from ben beneath or something. Have to go through the cave, yeah, they say. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. Well, let's do that then. We've got 2% power on the little device. Yeah, I'm coming up to get air and swap it. a boomerang fish that I prepared earlier. Well, I didn't prepare it earlier. I just caught it and held it in my hand. Passing 100 meters. Put Oxygen on the rebreather. Decreased. Oi. Shush. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. sure about this. No. I don't think I ever found this one. <laughs> Marvin Ling 01 says this game's aesthetic is so calming. <laughs> Shame about me. <laughs> Can anyone tell me what Cal's greatest fears are? All of them. Yeah, you're definitely looking at them. Everything about this game, like deep sea diving, um, 
big sea things with great big pointy teeth. Loud noises. <laughs> there doesn't appear to be a way to get any closer to it. Especially falling into the sun. Is that it? <laughs> Is that it? That looks like it, yeah. Oh, you didn't have to go through the cave. People were just lying. <laughs> it was just <laughs> round the back. See, never trust chat. Chat always lies. Okay. But always trust Sean. Yeah. That's okay, Ferk. I forgive you. You're usually not a liar. <laughs> Incidence of Ferk lying is significantly low compared with all. Oh. What's that then? You got a beacon fragment. Yay! But we've already got beacons, eh? Mm. Calorie intake recommended. Sea glide fragment. And look at this. Use, re use repair tool. Yeah. It's a good job, someone reminded you mm. to keep the repair tool on you, wasn't it? Because then I would have to go back and do it again. I wonder if this... Ah! Why is it shouting? It's the monsters that are right outside. <gasps> Yay! Blueprint acquired. There you go, you got the mobile vehicle bay. Nice! I don't think there's anything else ah! going in here that you don't already have. You probably have some calories. You should go back to the base and uh, cook that fish. Chat never lies to Cav, but then again Sean is playing right now. <laughs> there you go. Okay, <clears throat> thank you, thank you for doing that for me. It's alright. Nope, wrong. Oops. Face. Yes. I need to make um, a battery charging station too. Is it faster underwater? I think it is. Yeah. Go away! Making a battery charger might be a good idea. Hmm. I can just have a couple of batteries going at any one time. Well, the thing is, that will drain the power of the base to refill the batteries. Oh. And you're solar powered, mm. which means you're only going to be powering it during the day. So during the night, it will drain your power. But during the day, it will not. I needed some calories. I have some calories in. No! I'm here now. Wait. <sighs> Shit, I don't even know where... Ah! I'm out of me head with the hunger. Don't keep the sea glide out, because you're just wasting its light and running its battery out. Mm. Put some of these eggs back. Switch container, switch container. Make a, eat a little bit of fish. Yes, that's what I'm going off to do. Hooray, get the potato! Mm. Don't eat the marble melons like that. What, what should I be doing? Cutting them? Yes. You, oh. You cut those like that and then replant them. Yeah, but. Then how am I supposed to eat them if I cut them? Well, every you time? can eat free and uh, replant. Or eat one and replant free, you know, until you filled up the whole thing. 
But I can't, I can't eat the seeds. No. Well, you don't want to eat them all before you, you know, replant a bunch of them. I get that. So the bulb owes more water. Um, the potatoes give you more food. Mm. Nom, 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 nom. I'm a vegetarian now. You were correct about that's how to eat them, but I didn't want Kev to just eat them all and not have any seeds left over, you know. I knew that you need to plant them. Okay. I know how plants okay. work. Jeez. Jeez. Ass. Um. Habitat Builder. Oh, wait, I need batteries. How do I make... Oh, well, it's got no power, so... Take the power source out to your flashlight. <laughs> I'll swap it for one with 1%. Ah, <laughs> oh. All right, so let's see, how does one make a... <coughs> Ooh, excuse Cap. me, it's like every stream I, oh I burp gosh. once. It's really rude, I'm so sorry. It's terrible. It's really gr- I don't normally burp that much. Sorry, everyone. Yeah, I'm sorry too. I apologize for I'm that. more, I'm most sorry. Your idea. <laughs> Very rude. You should take both those silvers out. Yeah? What yeah. for? Well, you were planning on making a battery charger, weren't you? Oh, yeah. I thought the burping was just when you're tipsy. I know, I did too! But it's just like the last. I think it's moving to the UK has done this to me. I burp a lot more. And. A lot more, um, starts with ob, obligerently. Obligerently? No, belligerently. Obligerent. It's a perfectly cromulent word. <sighs> Battery charger, copper wire, titanium. So I need some kappa. <laughs> well, you just took ages to think of what word you wanted to and say, and then wrong. said a fake one. <laughs> uh, so you probably want to place this like set back a what bit, you like you know, in one of the corridor ends or something, because it folds out is the thing which makes it kind of a pain to get around. Oh. Like here? I mean, I wouldn't put it there. I'd put it like on a wall, set back somewhere. Here? Where there's space to get around it. See? Oh. Oh, I don't know how to get out of. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Got lost in my own circular room. Have I know language P. I feel like the more that I've learned languages, the more like this I've become. What's a belligerent in Japanese? I don't know. <laughs> I hate you. How do I I'm looking at battery? Well, that's your best battery. What do you mean? You unloaded an 85%. The scanner doesn't No, I didn't. It has one. You did. Oh, I did. You want to unload all your low ones and put them in. That one's 18% too. 
And it might be cute if you put a little box on the wall next to it for batteries. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You can swap them on. So then what do I do? They just charge slowly over time, yeah? Yeah, basically you should, you know, you should have batteries that you take out and then come back and you can swap them over with the ones in the Okay, <clears throat> that's a good idea. So you might need to make more batteries for stuff if you want to mm. get it It's like all, all of the, the acid mushrooms I've been picking up over time have been really necessary. Except you don't need to go exploring right now, do you? Because you so can I've make, collected so much already. You can make the mobile vehicle there. And then the Seymour. Can I? That's what we just did. Yeah, we got the mobile vehicle back. Oh, we did. That was cool. Um, how do you make a battery again? Copper or oh, I need a little bit more copper. Well, you might not need to because while you're making the seam off, all those might charge. Really? Well, I'll make a single battery anyway to at least put into my sea glider. Why did I put away all my... Oh, I'm so confused. There we go. Ah, I'm lo okay. I'm lost. Help! <laughs> it's oh, two acid mushrooms. <laughs> this is a fun game. <laughs> Are you looking after your plants properly, Kev? I mean, do, you ha do I have to water them? You just hit one with a knife. That's true. Okay, so... That one, exchange power source, 100%. Although it won't stay 100% if you keep holding it out in front of you with the light on, so put it away. There you go. <laughs> uh, okay, so nuclear waste disposal is not something that I really need at this point yet. What are you looking for? I'm looking for... The thing, the... The what? Oh, that's something in the fabricator, the mobile vehicle bay. Yeah, the deployables. Mm. Titanium ingot. Oh, I can make that. And lubricant power cell. So, lubricant, I need a creep vine seed cluster. I thought you had a lubricant in the box. I may do. Power cell, two batteries and silicon rubber. So I still will need to make... Um, batteries and titanium ingot which I can definitely make mm -hmm. how, how has this been for you so far compared to Outer Wilds it's it has brought, given me flashbacks <laughs> not gonna lie <laughs> um, like I'm really in, I'm really enjoying it you only need 10 but I, that can't count <laughs> But uh, it has also been scaring the shit out of me, and, I, and this is like early days yet. So I'm getting the feeling that Sean will gladly, as I understand it, be uh, taking over for me during the scary bits of this game. Hello. Ah! Olingus, thank you, welcome. Thank you for joining us. What was it? I needed two batteries. And the batteries are allowed to be flat, aren't they? Yeah, you could use flat ones. So I could just take these ones out. I mean, yeah, you could. I'll take the one that's got the smallest charge. <laughs> 43. You feel like you're cheating. Yeah. And lubricant. I don't think I have any lubricant anymore. Unless it's it was upstairs. By which oh, 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 by which I mean uh up in here. Is there anything in that box? I don't think so. I could take that down now. Gav hasn't fallen into the sun at all in this game, it's true. There you go, there's no reason to come up here anymore now. Yes, there is. What? From my health kit. Just put a health kit. No. Thing down there. Yeah, it is empty. I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> Bless me! Oh, 
I, I, I was too slow to press mute. I was reaching for the mute button. I promise. Is Cav just scared of everything in this in the game and there outside? Sorry, where am just, I going? You're just swimming off. Yeah, I'm going to get some uh, some of that uh, lubricant. Mm. Gonna. Ooh, ooh. Gonna just uh, lube up this old place. You Whoops. That's one way to get rid of him. Yay! <laughs> Just swim up and frantically start eating with kelp and panic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <I'm laughs> it was stress eating. Something else you can do to make your base a little nice to be inside is to put some windows in so you can see out. I guess so, but yeah. I mean this is just a temporary base, right? Because it's right temporary. near the beginning. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. What's happening? I'm scared. Oh, good night, William. It's what? a fish. Maybe that's why I need to have glass things so I can see if there's. to you that's not on you did get that radio message I remember about what a radio message about what something was hunting something <laughs> What is that? 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 What the fuck is that? Oh, what is that? What is that clipping through my house? <laughs> yeah, okay. There's a fish swimming around outside. It's really big! At least it's not making a noise anymore, so... Oh, I... You could put in a window in the corridor and have a Is that why you asked me to put a window in? Did you know it was No, coming? I didn't know that. I just thought you could do some windows. <sighs> So probably what happened. Ah! Sorry, probably what happened is what? <laughs> is when you went to grab that and swam back, a fish followed you. And it's now outside your base. When I went to get what? The lubricant? Yeah. Something found me. Yeah, something. It, it probably just followed you back. Well, it would have given up by now. Do I want to have this in, in my inventory? Yeah. Oh, jeez. It'll probably go away. It's just the game being... Ah! 
It's just clipping. You can just see it clipping through. It's outside. It can't get you. But, like, what is it? And why was it making that noise? Why is it on power? It's taking my power! It's taking my... No, Kev, Kev, it's just night, and your battery charger has drained the power. Oh. Ah! It's really big! I'm sorry about my... My terror. Oh, let's have a look. If you got glass, you could put a wall up. It sounds bigger than a stalker. Yes, it does. You want, would you like me to play for a bit? Wasn't a yes or a no. Ah! Oh no, it's just a stalker. What the fuck is it doing outside my house? It's stalking. <laughs> there, we, there's no metal doodads here. There's nothing for you here. Oh my god, I'm so I'm so cross. You got a radio message. What was it? Like sometimes stalkers will come clipping through your house. Yeah. <laughs> this is Officer Keenan, in light pod 19. The captain is gone. I have assumed command. The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. Hmm. We regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Stay together and good luck. This message will now repeat. Rendezvous coordinates corrupted. Transmission origin coordinates downloaded. Signal location uploaded to PDA. <laughs> so a stalker followed you back from the kelp forest, basically. Mm -hmm. What's wrong with having a stalker outside your house? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't like it. Um, Maybe it's time to make a stasis rifle. Yeah, stasis rifle. And I got these batteries charged. Yeah. And it's morning now, so it's morning now. Your power's coming back up. Yay! Oh I can see that. Okay, so what do I do with this should be in water to do <sighs> mm. Well why don't we look into getting a uh a habitat builder laser cutter we didn't make last time, did we? I don't know if you made that, but... Stasis rifle. Oh, we, we don't have magnetite. Yeah, that's the thing. You need magnetite. Mm. And I don't... That seems like it's probably from, like, a deeper biome. Well... I do need to build more batteries. With... And I need copper to do that. Uh, well, excuse me. Oh my have. god, I'm so sorry. Oh my god. It's so rude. I have a laser cutter here. Put that box away as well. This, oh yeah. That one goes in my feces locker. <laughs> How obligerant. <laughs> How obligerant. <laughs> someone moving furniture or was that something here? Well, there was drilling upstairs before, unfortunately, yeah. so I was hoping it didn't get worse. Okay. I'll just put this titanium away Stop. and then... Stop. Stalling. Out you go. I'm really scared, Sean. It's, it's gone now. Is it though? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I don't have any water. What happened to my water? You drank it all, but you can go eat the bulbo tree. Just remember not to eat the last piece. Bulber, bulber, bulber. Baggins. Oh, 
That'll do me for now, I think. Nom 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 nom. Yeah, I guess eventually I'll just sort of passively pick up enough copper that I can make batteries and just have like mm. a bunch on standby. Belligerent is the word that I was originally looking for. Why did I do that? I didn't look around first. Police vehicle bay? You probably got bored and went away. Oh, don't say that. When you say that, I don't believe you. I think you're trolling me. Mm. Okay, well, let's, uh... Let's climb. Oi! Climb it. Use vehicle bay. Vehicles. Seamoth. Wow! Oh, titanium. What is that? This smelly thing is going to kill me. Okay, no? Okay. Um, so I need a power cell. I, oh. Lubricant. Lead. I've got those things. I've got lubricant and lead. I've got enough titanium for an ingot. I can make another power cell and I... What are you doing? It's really distracting. It's a drone. It's your drone. I should just ride those around. Okay, so... Let's go make a vehicle. Welcome aboard, Captain. I need lead. While you gather all of that together, I'm going to go make myself a cup of coffee. Yeah? Yes. Good for you. Uh, lead... Wait, where's my, where's my... Cav doesn't drink coffee or tea. No. That's why I'm not offering one, not because I'm drinking. <laughs> Just to make that clear. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it was two glass. Oh, you can check ingredients in the blueprint menu. That's clever. Okay, so... Um, ooh, Cyclops engine. Ultra glide fins. Modification station. I don't have a modification station. Because I, I could do that. I've got enough stuff to make ultra glide fins. Hmm. Seamoth, titanium ingot. And power cell. I'm gonna use my last few batteries. Wait. Whoops. Mod stations are a bit later in the game. Ah. Seems this fan art is relevant still. <laughs> I can't see the, the fan art. Is, is it the one uh, where I keep burping and. <laughs> from when I was uh, streaming while drunk, as one does? Enameled glass. Oh, plastial ingot. Oh, all right. Got some new materials here to, to think about, and I can't remember what it was that I was getting. Power cell. Silicon rubber. Get some silicon rubber. Make myself a power cell. And what else did I need? Titanium ingot. I think that's ten. I feel like I might have like a thing where you don't where you can't count very well. Like my brain just turns into mush the the more we've got the more I'm counting. Makes it difficult because I'm also a musician, so <laughs> that gets in the way sometimes. I think I've got everything to make a thing. Oops. Hello. Ooh! Yelnenu! Yelnenu! I probably mispronounced that, but thank you so much for following. Pleasure to have you on board. Let's go climb onto this here thing. And make us a vehicle. The sea moth is a fast, oh, you had all the mm. But remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. I care not. Okay. Yes. 
Yes, please. I had to use all my ba all my last batteries to do that there. Um, I'm gonna. I'm assuming it doesn't disappear because that would be silly. The computer wants the player to have a tight ass. <laughs> Definitely need to make some more batteries. I need to get. Hi. Oh, talk gibberish! Thanks so much for following. Welcome, welcome. What was I getting? Batteries, but you don't have any copper, remember? No, I came back to get. Oh, I came back to get rid of all my excess shit. You can phrase that better. <laughs> well. And if you're gonna head out, you should probably fill up on food at the, uh, the old plants there. Yeah. Oh, these are all ready. Better not to eat the last one. One day I'm gonna do it just to spite you. <laughs> Is this a spoiler, a spoilered LP or no spoiler zone? Generally speaking, I like to go for like the old no spoiler zone, uh, and unless I really, unless I ask for help. I've played it before, but I'm not giving. Uh, I'll give indirect hints. Oh. oh, I don't like that I can see everything. Does this have a battery? Yes, uh, so it will run out of charge and you will have to make a new power cell for it. Oh, really? Um, but there are ways to get around that later on. Ooh. Can you I should basically things? Well, you should use this not to explore places where, you know, you can swim to. Like, if you've got this, you should head and try and, uh, you know... To explore the distress signal. Yeah, because this has a maximum depth of 200 meters. Oh, okay. So there are the stress signals lower down that you can probably head to. <laughs> Considering that Sean is literally here to backseat, we're a little bit more liberal with telling Cab where stuff is, and also being vague and frightened them. <laughs> Shall we go for this one? That's 175 meters, so that's like a place I've never been to before. That one's too deep. What are these noises? I, I don't remember hearing... That's them, the sea cows. That's, I've never heard them sound like that before. Well, that's the, like, you got too close, so now I'm gonna oh. gas at you noise, I think. Am I safe from enemies? Um, Some. From, from these ones? Some enemies. Like the, the big shaky head one that's around here? Am I safe from that one? You are. I think it can still damage the, the ship. Okay. And I have oxygen under. Oh! Yeah. So you can leave the sub and use it as like a little portable source of oxygen. Hmm. Okay. So that helps me to go deeper. That's good. Yeah. So with the rebreather, you could technically take this down two hundred meters and then swim another hundred down from it. Right. Where's the beacon at? To the right of you. Ah! Whoa! What happened there? Hi. <laughs> this one's spinning. Oh wait, that's the wrong yeah, one. Yeah, that's the wrong one. It's behind you. To the right. Left. Down. Right. Mm. Down. Can you see it? You got it? Yeah, there yeah. you go. Okay. I don't like this. Everything's new. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no! What's wrong? Just, just stop. Stop. Fully. And just take it in. Hey there. 
Oh, hello, thank you for following Lame Name 255. <laughs> I became a Straight different out. person. Yeah. In this area is dominated by plant life, picking up faint or terror vehicle signatures. Oh, okay, well, that's good, so it's mainly plants. Nothing's gonna hurt me here, except I'm guessing those will probably attack if they're frightened. 250 meters underground, I mean underwater, that's not the one that we're after. No, that's that we're one. after this one. Well, approach it slowly. Why? Because there might be other stuff in this area. Well, I can always come back later when I'm less frightened. <laughs> Did you bring any beacons? By the way? Yes. Should I put a beacon here? That's just if you find something interesting. Mm. You know, you could write down what you found. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Oh, this is nice and safe. Whoa! Are they boomerang fish? I'm kind of scared, actually. These rays don't seem to be attacking you. Well, let's stay here and see if it comes towards me, like if, if it does damage to the ship. It just goes through that one. You could scan it to find out its temperament. How do I scan it? Through well, you need to get out and get your scanner out. I don't want to get out. I'm scared. Passing 100 mm. meters. Mm. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Pass Can I eat you? The data bank showed up. Oh, good. Where, where, oh, it's down there. Okay. Can I scan like these little things, or are they not? They're just sort of valuable? like background graphical things. Okay. Ah. Okay. Abandoned PDA. So you can listen to what happened to them. Wait, where's my torch at? Oh, it's got no battery. Shit. What did I do? Oh, I dropped it. You dropped what? My torch. <laughs> I guess you've this got is the... a torch, yeah. And Just... you've got lights on. Do I? The ship. The but I can't look inside it. Yeah, you can. You can park it above with the flashlights on looking in. But is there even anything else here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so I just need to listen to the to the log. Alright. So we're back in here. Uh, what does PDA stand for in this game anyway? I think it's personal desktop assistant. Okay, let's listen to this uh, LifePod 13 emissary's voice log. pleasures as I give to those who seek pleasures from me. External temperature approaching critical levels. Show me the path in life, truth, and love for mine is the power. I am the one on and off and on again. Impact imminent. Life is a game which the universe plays with itself. I am done playing as this bundle of flesh. Return me. Well, that's what happened there. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Didn't really get that, but uh, cool. So you might want to flick the headlights on and oh. see what you do. And there might be new things to scan in this area, new types of materials to grab. Hmm. You might want to come up with a name for this biome for Outer Beacon, so you know how to get back here in the future. There are those 
this around. You can re-enable the life pug marker. All oh, right, so that was life pug marker thirty. But look, you're okay. It just bounced off the sub. Nothing happened. See, look, it did. It just put a little dent in the sub. But you can repair that with the repair tool. You're fine if you're in the sub. That's just one of the little enemies that are in areas like the stalkers or the uh, the wriggly cockroach sharks, you know. How are you doing? You alright there? <laughs> I'll get you back home to where you are. <laughs> Because you you didn't have the lights on, so you couldn't see. I mean, that's probably for the best, isn't it? No, because if you could see it off in the distance, you could avoid it, or you'd know it was coming at least. <sighs> Why would you do this? <sighs> Catch your breath. <sighs> I'm never going back there again. There you go, look, it's already fixed. Oh. Welcome aboard, Captain. That was an enemy about the size of the stalkers. It was massive. It's about stalker size. But bigger. It's the big ones you have to worry don't about. Don't touch me, please! Don't touch me, my friend! <laughs> oh my we god. We need to establish some boundaries here. Oh my god. Oh god. I'm very sorry I spoke to you, Captain. <laughs> oh. 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 Yeah, just decorating and gardening from here on in, I think. <laughs> Uh, let's go find some copper. Okay, well you don't really need... Well, what you can do is use this to find new wrecks, like in the red zone. In the red zone. Well, the that's where... Is. is that where we found the bit of the scanner room? Um, because if you could build the scanner room, then you could scan the whole area to look for, like in particular, where ores are and things yeah, like that. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. If you go in that close to the Oh oh that's that's a good thing, right? No, the I see teeth. Teeth? Where do you see teeth? There. They look like teeth. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna save. I've got a death wish now. Ah! <laughs> You jumped out of it. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? <laughs> it's immediately I'm just saying the heck the death wish now. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. These are good. They have resources on their back. They're friends. But why is it playing the scary music? Leviathan? This first life form is in excess of 30 meters long and has been designated Leviathan class. Fortunately, it feeds exclusively on plankton like life forms in the water. 
chitinous, chitinous shell. Most of the life forms topside, and I'm still sort of panicking in my stomach. Most yeah. of the life forms topside and some of its underside is protected by a thick layered exoskeleton. This suggests an evolutionary path quite different from other organizations on 4546b, most of which are vertebrate in nature. Reefback species, please don't be poisonous tentacles because you're going to like hit me. Okay, that's good. Um, the reefback species has likely been able to grow far larger than other herbivores because anything large enough to break through its uh, shell has long since gone extinct. Enzyme pods. Similar in appearance to the algae glands of the gasopod, these organs on the reefback's underside serve some unknown purpose in its digestive system and are capable of expelling small quantities of stomach enzymes into the surrounding waters. Mm. You might want to read this where you're not running out of oxygen. No, it's alright. Local <laughs> microcosm. An array of different barnacle and plant species grow on the reflex shell, thrusting their roots into ancient scars in the chitin, and taking advantage of their... Oh, there's another one! Of their mobility to avoid predation. N nonetheless, reflex will often be pursued by the foster hunger herbivores, and thus... This leviathan species is a mobile microcosm worthy of use of study in cell. Actually, yeah, we'll go up to the surface, I think. Just, just for a little bit. Yeah. Whoa! Okay. Life cycle. Reefax lifespans likely extend through many centuries should they survive their initial growth cycle. For the first few decades, their smaller size would make them vulnerable to carnivorous leviathans. Carnivorous leviathans. What about them? Are you scared of the hint that there are carnivorous leviathans in the game? There are. It's one just over there. Ah! <laughs> Sociable, seen as travelling in small ponds. And ponds? Small pods. Wow, that's... Be a tight squeeze, wouldn't it? <laughs> Communicating by an echoing call. Behaviour is consistent with low-level sentience. Assessment, harvest plants, small fish, and metal-rich barnacles. Oh, we want metals. Hey, where'd it go? Well, the thing is, one thing that I will tell you that might surprise you is that some of the plants can be defensive plants. So if you get stung or something shoots at you or something okay, like that, Okay, thank you. explode. How do I get up you? Let me on. Boy, did you hear me? Let me on your back. Let me. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, this one looks like a defensive one. Break barnacle. Let's scan before we approach. That seems like the good thing. Furled papyrus. The function of the distinctive curled leaves on this aquatic plant is not immediately clear. It's possible the leaves unfurl in low light conditions or that they're designed to channel water currents through the main body of the plant, thus enhancing nutrient take up. Break barnacle. You dropped something on the ground. See, you hit it, it drops something, and then you have to click on the finger. Yeah, I clicked a few times. Yep, yeah, but you have to aim at it. I mean, you're, you're not, you're just clicking it. I don't it even know where you it is. You need to use your eyes and look to see where it goes. Wait there. That's the thing. Regress shell. The specimen, specimen is composed of a complex series of regressing rings connected by tendrils. Okay, I want barnacle. Oh! Oh! Oh. Barnacle. Mmm, there was this like chain in the States called Barnacle Bills. It's probably not very good, but like, uh, I have fond memories of it as a child because it was the first time I'd. Whoa! The first time I'd had uh, shrimp. Like, fried shrimp, and my goodness. <clears throat> A complex cave dwelling flora specimen. This bright yellow core of this plant, uh, the bright yellow core of this plant is protected by a rigid cage, presumably to ward off medium sized herbivores. Barnacle William. <laughs> oh, tiger plant. That sounds frightening. That 
Okay, that one's definitely. This plant is adapted to sense fluctuations in the water at up to 15 meters, and is capable both of prehensile movement of its tubes as well as the propelling of thorns at speeds of up to 10 meters per second. Although capable of incapacitating small herbivores, this plant lacks carnivorous digestive organs. Would be predators caught in its defensive perimeter serve as a warning to other herbivores not to approach. It's like the, what are they called? The, um, the hanging cages that they used to put pirates and stuff that they caught in to ward off other people. Yeah. Iron, not Iron Maiden. Uh, anyway. But Zeppelins. Sure. And then as they decompose, they serve as fertilizer for the type of plant. Assessment, avoid or incapacitate. Oh, I want more barnacles. Oh! Well, it had barnacles on its back and you smashed them and let the resources roll off into the sea. Oh, so they're in the sea now. God damn it. Well, I guess I gotta just find another one. You are also not very far away from, if you recall, where the Ooh. life pod was that's on the surface. I'm gonna do it. What is that? It was a copper ore. Yes! That's what I need for batteries! I'm gonna sneeze. I'm gonna mute this. <laughs> that muted, yeah? <laughs> that was the most embarrassing sneeze. It was the coordination. I don't know. I think you got it in time. So you only deafened me. <laughs> it, it sounded like the cry of a parrot. <laughs> I think my, my face, my brain just got confused with like the multiple actions. So the sneeze came out as a really weird noise. I'm so glad no one heard that except for Sean. You weren't telling me. You just did. Yeah, well, you won't. You won't tell it at parties. To embarrass me. So where, where was this thing that you're talking about? What thing? You said there was. What are you doing? Seeing if I can collect the. Balls. No, they fell into the sea. Like fell all the way down. Yeah, and I'm not looking for those. I was, I was looking at. At its genitals, or anything? I was not talking about its genitals. Also, do you not want your Seamoth anymore? <laughs> yeah. What I was talking about was you are not far away from the life pod that was on the surface. That's the neighbor upstairs. Yeah, um, so <laughs> the beacon. What is that? What is that amount of spell? Oh, that's light. So you didn't have a beacon to this Welcome one. Aboard, so. Do you remember you've you got a picture of a life pod that's on mm. the surface near the ship? Yeah, and it was like behind the thing. No, it, it wasn't. I'm so glad that yep. sneeze was muted. You, can you look at that picture? I wasn't given a picture, was yes, I? Yes, you were. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I was. <clears throat> oh. Uh, alien facility locations. See, so you could go to there to life pod for, <laughs> couldn't you? Yes. Using where the ship is to orient this. Ah! Oh! Okay, yes. So it's like here, right? No. No, it's not. Look at where it is. You're looking at the bit of the ship you can see. Hmm. But remember, the ship is really big. It's huge. Yeah, but, but what I mean is that it is in this direction. I went back. No, please help me. I'm, you know, I'm bad at okay, this. Okay, so you want to be where it is, looking at the ship. So where you are looking at the ship looks the same as that. Yeah. Yeah. So it's not near that. You can see that from where it is. Yes. Yeah, but it's not near it. Yes. You, that's just the angle. But it's, it's closer at it. to it. So like I'm going in the right direction by going closer to it, right? Okay, so that's a no. I'm gonna get some more barnacles and abandon that mission, because that's too frightening. Seek fluid intake. Ooh. Seek fluid intake. Oh, I got no fluids. Eh? Did I get it? Oh. Hmm? 
Yeah. Sorry about all the clicking, everyone. Shut up. It's so mean to me. Oh, there was something I could pick up. I'm hoping I'll just grab some copper and then I'll go back and back into the sheep. You look fed up, Sean. I'm not fed up. I'm anxious. You're anxious? Yeah. About me. What is It's a bubble. Oh my god. Yeah, you need to go and make some uh Vasa. Can I just drink the sea water? No, you can't. Okay. I wouldn't go behind the ship. No. I, I, oh, what are you doing up there? Stop it! That's probably the one that was like following me around before. Messing with me. Like a complete shit. Oh! Marvin Ling, thanks for subscribing! Welcome to the club! If you have Discord connected with Twitch, Welcome then aboard, you are now a member of my exclusive to patrons and subscribers, Twitter subscribers, Discord thing. Twitch subscribers. Twitch subscribers, yes. <laughs> Shut up. So, bottled water is still handy Vital to take with you. It seems that way, yeah. Stop encouraging Cav. Oh, Glocus92! Thanks for subscribing! Welcome! It was actually Bodhi gifting. Oh, Bodhi! Thanks for gifting! Very kind. Yay! I'm not dying anymore. Plus, yeah, that was uh, that previous one because that didn't show up in the, uh, the chat cav. As people point out, that was probably a patron. It was probably a patron. Mm. Oh, it. Oh, okay, right. Yeah, it's either a patron or it is a uh, YouTube subscriber. <laughs> I have too many things connected to this, and I need to distinguish between them. What are we working towards at this point? I don't know. You wanted me to explore some stuff, but I'm too scared, I think is what it came down to. Oh, I wanted to make some batteries. Well, you have all the light pod signatures and uh, hints. I do, don't I? Yeah. That was a YouTube one. That was a one. YouTube one? Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> that's also very welcome. I've got a few videos coming up soon. Um, I'm almost done with my latest Jim Carrey-thon um, video about Batman Forever. And I'm also getting ready to record the... Why do you keep making videos about Jim Carrey movies? Because... They're fully charged. Um... And also, I'm doing getting ready to record the audio for a video about decolonization 101, which should be very exciting. Eighty-seven, ninety-five. Okay, everything, everything else is doing well. Yeah, you're doing well for batteries right now. So I'll make like a battery cupboard here. Wait, that's the wrong one. Mm. Um, Sean also has a YouTube channel, but he's only making videos about weird race science and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hardly realistic. Wall locker. Oh, I don't have titanium. On me. On me. Whoops. I need to uh, stock up on titanium at some point. Locker. Nope, that's also the wrong locker. Silver. And 
used now. Wall locker. I thought you said this one opens out. It does. No, it doesn't. Oh, like out in front, like that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, when it when it's in use. <clears throat> you should probably keep two spare batteries on you. Yeah? Well, yeah, I mean, when you're out and about. You might yeah, need I guess so. Ah, oh, well. We're well overdue for another Cinema Sins video, Sean. When I get to one million subs. Oh. Um. Which is going to be never, so I don't have to do it. I mean, you say that. I've pushed it in so far into the future, though. Oh! It's like time. I don't like it. Oh, my scanner's running low on battery. You know what that means? It means... Scanner's low on battery? Does your scanner have a battery? I didn't think it did, but uh, it apparently does. Oh. It never shows up. Well, just pop that in the charger then. Hit R to get to the batteries. Yeah, it does. Hmm. I'm gonna charge my first real battery. Well, that was another one that I charged before. But... Yay! Oh, I don't like it. What's this light? Is the light coming from the ship? It is. It's the flashlight's on the front of the Seamoth. Oh, wow. So since you've got the Seamoth now, you can go have a look around. Mm. To deeper places. I don't want to. I don't, I don't know if I can. I'm frightened. I... Well, that <laughs> life pod was on the surface, wasn't it? Mm. Ah, yeah, that's true. But then you weren't, you were, weren't going to backseat. Oh, is that it? That's your own one. You just turned in a circle. I thought that might be. I think the perspective is thrown you off here, and the size of the ship is thrown you off. So it's very far away from you. And yeah, I figure it is, and it's like in this direction, left. right? Way left, way left, like mm -hmm. that. Okay. Now I am just backseat. <laughs> I'm, I'm okay with that, because I'm currently very hey frightened. Then. Oh! Obnox or a bee! Thanks for following! I hear whales having a fun time. Oh! Oh, what is that? Oh. So it's the whale. It's the Yay! Whale before. So pretty. If anything comes out to get me, I'm going to be really upset. Oh, what's that on the surface there? Why is the water all... Oh! Oh. What's that? And more importantly, what biome am I in? This is shallows, right? That's good. This is good. Yay! You might want to stay in the ship and make look Really? How well, come? Well, just to get a sense of what is around in this area before you go up and out. Special equipment is required to collect this resource! Okay! Alright, okay, I get a bit more of a sense for what is around here now, and I'm going to go back into the ship and cry. So, we'll get some of this too, and we'll get some of that, and I'll get some of that. Oh, a little peeper. Now, so that's a special lead thing that I need a special tool to Welcome do. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, there's another one. Looking around. I don't want to have another one of those unpleasant surprises. I don't... I mean, that scrap metal is going to lure one of those creepy fish, but if I just go really quickly... Haha! Yes! What did you get? A battery. 
Cool. So you're alongside the ship now. And you actually... Am I? You saw but then forgot about the thing that you came here to find. The lifeboat? <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, turn around. Oh, it was that thing. You looked at it and then you went, ooh, what's that? And then you looked at something else and went, ooh, what's that? And immediately forgot about this. <laughs> Didn't you? Yes. Yeah, you did. This is an interesting one. Like, it's still got the creepy, like, stalkers, but they're in a different sort of biome. I think they were creeping in from the next biome over. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, it's upside down. That doesn't look good. Yay! They're not going to be needing that. Creature decoy? Oh! Creature decoy, I don't remember that one. Why does this blobby... What is this blobby thing? Oh, that's the surface of the water. Yes, it is indeed. PDA. Integrating new PDA data. Oh, there's do my you want to read the crew log? Yeah, I guess I should do that, but maybe, you know, get into a place that has air. Like I see. This one? Life pod 4, crew log. Okay. All right, let's have a listen, shall we? To any Altera crew. Landed in area of significant alien activity. Encountered predators in the Leviathan class, highly aggressive. Mm. Spectroscope scanner assigned species designator, Reaper. One specimen mm. attempted to swallow the life pod, doing extensive damage in the process. Only viable option is to make for the safety mm. of the Aurora crash site. I have retrieved a data box with the creature decoy and enough resources to fabricate a couple of them. The swim's longer than the decoy lifetime, but it should just be enough to keep them busy. If you don't find me on board the ship, I presume I miscalculated. Uh, didn't I get something else as well? Was that the, the decoy thing? You picked up the creature decoy thing. Drooping stinger. Survival package? Oh. Blueprint database corrupted? Oh, okay. Should have read all this stuff before. Habitat installations, bulkhead door, scanner room. Mm. That's really handy. Yeah, I want that. That can be used to scan for resources, and you can get a, a chip you can put in your suit that will show you where it is as it scans, so you can go out. That sounds good. I have not been resources. on the ship yet, no. Um, creature decoy. This advanced deployable is a catch-all solution for mimicking the behavior of a living creature for purposes of scientific re research or predator evasion. Vibrate cycles air and water and sends out randomized high frequency sound waves to emulate a living organism. May be hand placed or launched from compatible Cyclops submarines. Short onboard battery provides limited lifespan. Attracts predators of all kinds. Great. Oh, okay. So I might want to get like one of those and just like have a bunch of fish in there just for eating later. There's no need to feed or care for your subjects. I don't care for these <laughs> fish. But yeah, they don't breed in there. You need a alien container to breed them. But you can use that as like fish storage. You know? mm. How do I get a... I very, very much want to... Uh... An alien containment unit. Okay. That's cool. And I can work on one of those as well. But I don't have magnetite. Hmm. Pathfinder tool. Oh no. Well, there's more uh, things in this area, isn't there? 
like you were finding salt, you could stock up on some salt, and you were finding boxes with things in them. Yes. So you yes, could probably search around the other side of the ship. Can I go onto the ship at this point? Um, it might be tricky for you right now. As in, there are scary things. Oh, I mean, that's always going to be the case. Shit. But um, you need particular tools in order to access it easily. You know? Yeah. Oh, what's that light down there? Oh! oh! E, you were too far at the... Oh, no! You were too close to the shallows there. I don't like that. Here is the voice of logic. Go home. Mm. I wonder What's if they'll attack each other. It's not over there on the ground. That looks like a scanner thing, but uh, I'd very much like these fish to sort of like get out of the general area before I go over there. Oh wait, no, I was looking at I was looking at that, like the point that I'm looking at. What's that over there, lying out in the sand? Lying out in the sand? To the right. To the right. That. Near the centre. Left. Down. That. Yeah. What is that? I don't know. I don't know what it is, but go have a look. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh! Oh, please let them kill each other. I think it's dead. No, it's not. Is it? Yeah, I think it's dead. Oh wait, no, it's not. It's just uh, <laughs> trying to lure you in. Yeah. If I hide in there, will it be? Mmm. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm going in. Uh, I'm going in. I'm going in. You got a new blueprint. Transmitter. Well done. What does that do? I would guess from the name. It transmits power. Yeah, I don't know what that means. Power transmitter. <laughs> Is that the infamous cockroach fish? Um. I want another scanner room. Extends the range of a power source? Mm. Why would that be good? Like, what power source? Well, in the future, remember, you might have to build bases in places that can't see the sun. Oh. So your solar power would be very good. Uh huh. But there might be other sorts of power that you mm. can use, and if it's too far away from the base, you could link it with a power source. Hmm. That's just scrap metal. You're gonna have to like just say. <laughs> that was a very manly scream, just wasn't it? Walk that one. <laughs> I really want to find. I really want to make a scanner thing, but I I need some kind of a scanner to know where all the equipment is. Did I lose a sub to clipping? That sounds like something that would happen to me. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Well, it's good, you got water, so you can just drink it. Seek fluid intake. And the jelly shrimp. <gasps> oh, yeah. Jelly yeah, shrimp? Cool. In the jelly shrimp cave, you lost a ship. I remember something like that, yeah. That's funny. Well, you certainly know it won't happen to me. It's like these lead eggs. Special equipment is required to collect from the big nodes. Welcome mm. aboard, Captain. Uh, okay, so we need to find. You could head back to the thing, but like along the bottom, so you can see if there's new things to scan. That's true. I mean, the scanner. We found the scanner part in like the red biome. Yeah, which is down here. Okay. 
Although that was part of a room, so you wouldn't find it in the little box. Although there may still be stuff in the little boxes. Yeah, it was like a big. Passing one hundred meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. I think you'll mainly find laser cutter fragments. That seems to be what you've been finding here. Yeah. I'm pretty sure the scanner thing was just in the open. It was, yeah, it's because it's part of a room. So it's it's a big scan. Like what's this on the edge? It's what? Oh I thought it says something. You gotta like look for wreckage, basically. Like large amounts of wreckage and then they'll probably Yeah, there might be some bits not near large amounts of wreckage, but like I think I actually see large amounts of wreckage to the left. The left. That's where the scary thing was. Oh, that's just the life pod again. But there is also this. And there's titanium there, so that means that I must have searched this yeah, place you must before. Have it. What was that noise? And that's the table you scanned as well. Okay. You're gonna go to sleep now! Hope you sleep well, Marvin Ling! Wait, isn't this near where there was like a, a sunken ship? Like over there? Is that the yeah, sunken ship? Yeah, I think that is, yeah. yeah. And you needed the ah! laser cutter to get And I have a laser cutter now! Yeah, so you could do it. Let's do that now. Okay. Just park this up near the entrance then. Which is? There's one. Right there. You can go in there. Okay. But park the ship really close to it. Why? Because that's your source of oxygen. Snort at me. Have I been to that pod? Yes, I have. Whoa! No, down! C. Down. C. C. Oh! How's that? Very good. Laser cutter. Laser cutter. I'm um, gonna use my laser cutter. Do I use it here? No. Fine. Try it anyway. Oh, whoops. No. Mm -mm. No. Eee! Passing 100 Ooh. meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Okay, that's the way out. Here. No. Right, do you want me to just tell you? Yes. Okay, go back up. Refill your air at the ship. Oh, radiation detected. Yeah, keep that on. I don't like this noise. Oh! What's, what are the noises? Hmm. It was here, right? Yeah, it's in there. Okay, so we'll get some air. Oh, Sean, I'm so scared. You're doing fine. Mm. I scanned all this stuff. Oh, propulsion cannon. Oh, did we? Why did we not scan that before? I was in here before. I didn't see it. Ha! <laughs> Can I repair this? Doing it? Yes. It's ticking up, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Mm. Here's a cutter fragment. Mm. Mm. Open the other box. Lightweight, high capacity tank. Let's get some air. And then we'll continue our search. What's the lightweight tank again? No idea. Let's find out. Let's again. Lightweight, lightweight, lightweight. <laughs> Shut up. 
pink. Data. 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 Same capacity but increases your swim speed. Oh, let's see. Swim? It'd probably be an equipment. Oh, okay, equipment. Not. Pull the trigger once. The object can now be safely retrieved from the gravitational beam. Okay, so I could like grab shit that like right out of those stalkers' mouths. <laughs> yeah, or to oh. move things. Habitat installations, maybe? Yep. Not all of them have data bank entries, apparently. That's weird, because the whole thing was that I picked it up as data. Okay. I don't like the noises. They're freaking me out. You didn't open that box. I know. I know me. <laughs> Fuck I you! Me. Stop it! Zone. No, I'm not. It will say it when I change uh, head things. There's nothing down here. I can see, but surely there's a reason for me to go down here. There is, yes. Does it involve me using my space? eyes? Yes. <laughs> Please tell me. Okay, there's a door. Okay. There. No. Well, what you're doing is you're moving around the walls, looking at each inch of the wall individually, when you could just stay still and pivot your eyes around until you see. Right, but you should go get more air, because you've... I'm stuck. Oh dear. Oh dear. Thirty seconds. Okay, so now I swap. You see, it tells me. It tells me when one is required and one is not. Yeah. Uh -huh, not so smug now, are you? Yeah. Because you're ten seconds away from a source of oxygen, so there's no need to use the rebreather. But I was running out of oxygen. No. Nope. Wrong. Back. No. You should drink your water as well. Door, door. Oh, there. Yeah. <laughs> Did you have to be saying the word door in yes. order to see the door? That's right. Stay hydrated. Yay! Now, that's very handy to make. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's also handy. What was it that I picked up? Um. Yeah, you can take a look. There's more stuff in here, but again, you're uh, only got 30 seconds left. 30 seconds. Okay. There's no getting out, you have to go back the same way you came. Shit. Which is the way that Over I get? Over there. Okay. Through up. 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. No. Oxygen. Oh, shit! Left and right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try this again. Okay. See you later, Diana. Enjoy your food and uh, enjoy your art stream. In case you don't know, Diana Jack, Diana does um, art streams every Friday. 
and they're always a lot of fun. So if you enjoy art streams, she's probably a good person to follow. What? There's more stuff that's going on here. In here? Yes. Like what? Oh, this. Wait, I've already scanned the mobile vehicle. Can't scan that light. What light? The standing light. Ooh. What's that? Also, does it have a battery in it that you can take? New blueprint acquired. Did it? Down. No, no, it doesn't. Ha! Sorry, that doesn't benefit me. Hang on. Like... What? Why ha? It's because it was on, and they usually take batteries to power them. So... Thirty seconds. You're gonna die now, and I'm not gonna tell you how to get back. Have I seen everything that's here? You, you're gonna die, Kev. You're dead. Don't! You need to swim back up. I'm trying! Oxygen. I don't know where I get... Oh, oh, geez! I'm gonna die! I don't know where anything is! Fuck! Oh, shit! Oh, no, this is the worst. This is like... This is my worst nightmare. Can we not? Can we... I was telling you. <laughs> you gotta keep an eye on your oxygen. There you go. Lost some belonging. But you're fine. You got all the scans. You don't lose those. Good. You just need to go and get your ship back. I lost all my ore. I'm in shock and oh! I mean... Oh, that's right. Yeah, you did. I'm very cross. I'm very cross. Take out all my... Oh, shit. Don't, mi don't let me do this again. Oh, okay, good. You can plant two whole trees in the space. Yeah. Yeah, God, I'm such an arsehole. <laughs> So the thing is, if you instead knife two of them, uh, you can make time, more you next could make time. More of them, yeah. Mm. Uh, yeah, that's something to keep in mind, huh? Oh my god, I'm such an arsehole. I'm so grumpy with myself. Just go get your ship back. Oh, that means I have to swim all the way there. Yeah, but it's not in a dangerous place. Yes, it is. <laughs> it's really not. I'm never gonna find it, Sean. Oh. Oh. Well, you, it, the icon will be on your map, like on your hood, so you can turn to look to see where it is. It'll be on my hood? Yeah, H and U. No, I mean, you. Just by looking around, you'll be able to oh, see. Oh, okay, cool. You can put some emergency seeds in a cabinet, that's a good idea. Oh, that wasn't that far away, was it? Oh, wait, no, that's my ship. Yeah. What's if, that? If you even, like, that's your mobile vehicle. Oh. If you okay. glance away from the screen for a nanosecond, all the information goes out of your head. I've noticed. It's very fun. You can be pointed at this, but you'll look away and turn at the same time. And then you'll come back and just be holding W in a ridiculous direction. Wait. <laughs> the Seamoth one. Shut up! Oh, that's right. I lost all my shit that I was picking up. You didn't lose your tools. Not my tools, but like basically all my resources that I picked up. Ah! 
within 100 meters. Oxygen <clears throat> efficiency decreased. Okay, there it is. <coughs> Had I found everything there was to find here? I think so. Okay. See, look, he sneezed, and now you. I'm coming up for air! Look, it's there in the ship. You were close to the ship. Oh, yeah. The surface. <laughs> Still getting used to having that option. <laughs> So you can, you got a propulsion cannon there, you can make a propulsion cannon. Assuming you've got the, uh... What does that do again? It makes me swim harder. No. That doesn't sound fun. He's <laughs> just aim it behind you and fire. Uh, so no, the propulsion cannon uh, allows you to move objects. Oh. Just hanging out. Hanging out. With the yeah, the lightweight tank is what makes you swim faster. Okay, have I got that? You also picked up the data for that. Yeah. Oh, this is a huge chunk. Dang! I'll take this little chunk. I need special equipment. You can also try heading down from the red zone and see what's even lower. Here? So it looks like... Mm, it no, looked, that's the place that had the thing that, that attacked me. What's there was that? a shark that bumped off the sea moth. Yeah, but it, did, it didn't do very much damage. Lithium. Okay, so they're just bigger chunks. Yeah, the bigger ones you can't get yet. Yet. So it goes like safe shallows, then the kelp forest, then the red zone than the mushroom forest, it looks like. They just sound like sonic levels. Oh, what's this? What is that? This looks like what I want. Moon pool fragment? I would highly suggest looking for a fragment. You reckon they'll be around here? Well, you know that they're in the mushroom forest now. Oh. And you're sure that that enemy that, that went into me was like the... That was a regular enemy. They're annoying and they do uh, loud screams that are scary. <gasps> uh, no, what was it? Was it one? <laughs> Shut up! But is it? Th is that one of the the ones from the red area? Is what I wanted to know. Was it, is that what it is? No. It's a new one that's bigger. It's a new one. It's not oh. bigger. Oh. It's around the same size. Oh no! Oh. Exploded some gas at me. What is this? Is that like an egg? Yes. Looks like an egg. Mm. Okay, so now I'm gonna be very calm. Aren't I brave? You're being very brave. Yeah, yes. I was just re very recently traumatized by this place, and here I am coming back. What's very that on the ground myself. over there? That looks like lithium. Some more salt tree mushroom. Oh, that must be edible. <laughs> or I may never find out. Some did go in your inventory. Yeah. Let me know. Okay. Um, where is it? Flora. C. Wait, what? Indigenous flora contains fungal enzymes. It's not really giving me the option to consume it, but... Uh... <laughs> Just immediately try eating it. What? I like mushrooms. I don't like the texture. Yeah, I mean, they tend to be on the slimy side. I think people find that off-putting. So you want to keep your eyes peeled. What is that? You can scan. Modification station fragment. Okay, just need one more of those. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. 
It's Kito Kelsey Captain. Yeah. So this is a relatively safe area. And yeah. You can creep around looking for like materials. It's very sneaky how they have that occasional enemy though. That's not fair. They should be ashamed. Just you'll hear them before you see them. I don't remember hearing it, but then I'm not very observant. <laughs> If I hear them, should I just like get out of the area? No, no. You should try and locate where it is. I don't just know. move away from it. Is that it? Oh, I'm really scared. Look, you've got a job to do. You know, you're just moving through the mushroom forest, looking for more mm. fragments. No, no, I don't like it. Going in. The squeaking is the rays which are harmless, says Ferk. Okay. Okay, thank you, Ferk. I'm going to choose to believe you. Oh, what's that up there? It's a whale. It's one of the reef backs. Um, there's even more darkness down there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, okay. into a thing. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. Rip everyone's ears. Yeah, I'm sorry, everyone. I don't mean to be like this. Oh, oh! That looks like something. It does, doesn't it? And there's another egg, too. I'll take them both. Yay! Moon pool and egg. Shit, where's my ship? Yay! So there's also the modification station. What's that? I don't know. Cyclops hull fragment. Oh, that's good. We want that, don't we? Where's my ship? Oh, there. Okay. Oh! Safety of the ship. You didn't really I'm gonna know. write to Ridley Scott and ask him to base a character on Cav in the next alien oh, film. Oh jeez. <laughs> Would you watch that film, Sean? No. You yeah, don't need this many eggs as well. Oh, I can't see the thing I was looking at anymore. This blue thing. That's a scanning thing. Oh, it's an egg. But you're full of eggs. No, I want more! There's no reason to keep picking eggs up. Uh, if you've got one of each, you can find Really? Yeah, I mean, you don't even need any, really. <laughs> Oi! I need <laughs> eggs. God, I love eggs. Mmm. Protein. Now you just want to eat some eggs, then. Yeah. That'd be nice. Um. Okay, scanning for stuff. Have playing Alien Isolation. I will never play Alien Isolation. That one learns from you. That game, and I do not like that aspect of it. Wait, want me to grab something? Or was that just up? Oh, just get back in the ship. Oh! Ah! No, that was me. <laughs> you can't. Not everything in the game is scannable or gives you a resource. Some things are just there. Oh, Sean, I'm not going to be playing like 90% of the end game, just so you know. Why? I can't You're do it! You're doing really well! I never thought you'd get this deep. Oh, they're different! They're different! They've got their, they've got their eyes closed. The peepers. Well, you are shining the big flashlights in it. Do you think that's why? I don't know. 
Oh no, once you get deep, deep down into the water, the peepers are going to get really mean, aren't they? That's going to be a thing. It's a giant peeper. Ugh! Carnivorous peeper. You can make a moon pool now. That helps me breathe underwater, right? Well, going back and attaching a moon pool to your current base would be a good idea, I think. Really? Yeah. But I want to scan the rest of the scanner pieces. Well, the scanner pieces were in the red zone, weren't they? Oh, so yes, too they deep were. Right now. Oh, never say I'm too deep. That makes me frightened. You're still in the baby areas of the game. D don't say that either. This has been traumatic for me. What's this? It's the same thing. One hundred meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Mm. Is the next level down from this not a baby area? How come? Wait, why is it dark? Where's my light? Oh, here. Where are you trying to get to? Hmm. Okay. I want to see Cab hiding in a locker wondering if the alien will open it, and then it does. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I couldn't. I am thinking of playing Soma for um, the Scarathon, if I get in, if I get uh, accepted. They haven't started uh, releasing uh, the application form yet, but I'm strongly considering it. So the next level down from this one is, is less big. I can't remember. Very selective memory there. Why is it playing scary music? That's just the soundtrack. I hate the soundtrack. The soundtrack's great. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> the scary part of the game is the unknown. Late game is easier because you know what to expect, kind of. Hmm. I guess I can see that, yeah. Like, you just went past a whale, no problem, when you were scared by the Malia. Yeah. See, the more you learn about the game. Hmm. The less scary it is. Welcome aboard, Captain. I'll put away my 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 ergs. <sighs> Sean needs another coffee. Yeah. Don't speak to me before I've had my coffee. <laughs> he enforces that rule. <laughs> Uh, wait, what was I doing? I'm putting back all this stuff. I've got metal salvage that I can turn into titanium, which is good. I should probably make some more batteries too. I do want to have like a nice stockpile of batteries going on there. Um, in which case, I need to get copper. Oh. I need to find copper, apparently. I missed my potato plant. <laughs> Where's the okay here? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it, everyone. Wait. There we go. And now I'm gonna plant by right clicking. I'll probably just throw these out. Yay! Bulba plants! Bulba plants! Two 100% batteries! Nice! Okay. Add them to my collection. How are my other batteries going? 56 and 77. What I might do is uh, change this one. 100% and then I will pop this in there and then we'll have this spare one going. Why am I living in a hallway? <laughs> I don't know, I like I like the small places, it feels more safe. Okay, I need some copper, I think. 
<laughs> Predatory rent prices is why I'm living in a corridor. <laughs> it's copper time! I'll grab some of these finally. <laughs> While Sean's out. Otherwise he'll grumble at me. He'll get in trouble. What have I got to do to get some kappa? Is that it there? No. Hmm. Oh, it's so much more peaceful here where there's less dread. Whoa! I take that back! I think it was here? Yes. Really? I want to get some sulfur. Boo! Guess it must have been a different cave. building. What? What's scary? Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> Was I base build? Oh yeah, I had I had a bunch of blueprints, didn't I? I forgot about that. Alright, back I go. Go into this empty room downstairs and uh, back to that corridor that I call my home. <laughs> Tools. Nice. Okay, I just need a wiring kit for which I need silver, right? Yes. Um, Look up the ingredients for moon pool though as well. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Deployable? No, that'll be in your builder. Oh. Well, that's not what I want. What is that? <laughs> The Scooby Doo. Mm. Battery charger, aquarium. Oh, I want to get one of these. I want to get a bunch of fish for like emergencies. You could do that. Because mm. I do want to try to be vegetarian as much as possible. Modification station, ingredients unknown. What are you doing? Looking for. Vehicle upgrade console. Hmm. Let's do that, that shall we? Pool. Yeah. Okay. Power transmitter, floodlight. Can I just put that down anywhere? You can, although it runs on batteries and it will drain them, oh. or at least it used to. Moon pool, vehicle docking bay. I thought a moon pool is where you can breathe oxygen. Didn't you say that a moon pool is where you can breathe oxygen? No. Like, a moon pool is just a, a pool underwater. Confused now. You can breathe oxygen there, but that's not what you do there. Oh, okay. In this one, you can dock a vehicle. I see. Yeah. Well, we probably have enough to make that. So we need two lead, one lubricant, You're doing and quite good in that you, like... In that what? You praise have a lot of good material. <laughs> you weren't going to let my praise trail off there, No! You? In that, you know, you're getting it done. Yay! Immigrants. We <laughs> get the job done. Jeez. Yeah, you get that? It's Hamilton reference. Uh, no, I... I have not seen Hamilton. Used by uh, white liberals. <laughs> um, okay, so we need... No, we should be able to make it. it oh, used it's because we build it, yeah. It used two of... Uh, I think it used two ingots. 
look again at the requirements. See. Oh, okay, you so maybe I do need the, some more. It, some of them take multiple numbers worth of stuff. Okay. But luckily you've got it. Yay! Yeah, baby, I've got it. You'll probably need to reinforce your base first. Well, yeah, if you put another bit on the base, then it's likely that you will push the base's structural integrity. Yeah. So where would I put this moon pool? It, it outside of the place. It would yeah. be much easier to place outside. Yeah. Okay. No. Don't just start. Uh, press I... five to get rid of your builder. Or right click. So the moon pool's pretty big, and you need to be able to drive into it from underneath. So it might be better to branch it off from the upper room here. Okay. But you should get it back up so you can see what it looks like. Oh. Can it just be self standing? It can, but then that might then be. You, yeah, that's silly. How do I rotate it? It's weird, it won't let me like put it in. Well, you can probably put it next to it and then build a corridor between it. Or maybe you could build a corridor before and then try and attach it onto the end of the corridor. Like, that's a hatch, so you wouldn't be able to put it on there. Mm. Like, probably a corridor coming off there. Off the top or the bottom? Off here. Oh, yeah. Would be good. Yeah. And then you could attach this to the end of the corridor. But you'd have to place the corridor first. So it needs to go here. But no, lower down than that. That might be too low though, so... I mean, if you did that, you'd have to put another ring on top of that in order to branch across. There is one, the other side's lower. That's fair point out, is it? Or it, it might be good to get rid of this hatch and place it where the hatch is if there's space there. But, oh no, that's, that's a big low. pole in the way. Mm. Yeah. Or maybe you could attach it to the end of one of the corridors down there. Yeah, because you need to be able to get on, under it. Like, seems, yeah, it seems like it needs to be at least on the third story. So like, this is the lowest it, it can be. Can you go one to the right? Down? And down again? No. Yeah, well you'd have to put another room on top of there then. And will that damage the structural integrity of the vehicle? The, 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 the habita hab habita habitation? Go on, you can get there. Yeah, well, anything new that you build on will. Except for the structural reinforcements. Oh, there's one valid space next to the upper room but you haven't happened to snap to it recently. Was that it? Is that it? Do you want me to try to find it? What makes you think you do it better? I'd just job. do it faster. <laughs> yeah. Oh! There we go. Shall we? It might be a bit difficult to build that corridor, but you could. Yeah. What do you mean? Well, because there's no corridor. So it's just going to be freestanding. Yeah, and then, and then I'll to... build a corridor. Okay, but it might be a bit difficult to build a corridor. Oh. But mm. yeah, that would be a place you could put it. But it, if you're doing it in such a way that you place the moon pool first, you should place the moon pool first and then the corridor to attach it. Why? Well, because you don't know. Because. <laughs> Impatient. You don't have the titanium. Well, let's deal with that, shall we? Welcome aboard, Captain. I'm running out of titanium now. It'll be annoying to get in and out with the metal strut there. 
this thing. Yeah, I probably. Mean, you don't have many options, though. Unless I want to put it down here. I, I could also make it one story higher. This is probably fine, though. I could always redo it when I needed to. I mean, really, you could just move the entire base lower. How? I'll just build a new base lower down. Can't carry the stuff over. Oh, God. And it'll be in a danger zone. But you should just put a moon pool on this base, even if it's awkward. Just get it there. Right? <laughs> and then later, when you find a better place to build a base, then you can move over. Alright. Yeah. Uh, well. hey, what are you trying to do? Are you try just, yeah, you got it. You had it like ten times. <laughs> just having fun with the concept. Okay. See, now it can't go there. Why not? Because you put down the corridor first. I don't understand. Well, you should put down the moon pool first, and then the corridor. Why? Because it will work that way, and it won't work this way. <laughs> Ugh. This game's hard. probably have to get rid of that hatch and build a corner oh going around into it. Oh my god. What rot. After weeks without human contact, yeah. it is normal to experience psychological discomfort. Research indicates symptoms may be partly alleviated by adopting a pet or anthropomorphizing an inanimate object. And now building the corner that goes around to there will work. Mm. We're doing it! Yay! Ah, yeah. You did it. Okay, so I put the... Where is my vehicle? Look at us! I mean... Not to reinforce the base, I'm being told. I mean, your old problem with not being able to read text on the screen is... Oh, damage due to weak hull strength. What is damaged? The entire base. The entire base? Yeah. Build reinforcements. Oh, no! Should I not park until it's been undamaged? Well, you need to fix the base. Yeah, this is not ideal, is it? Ooh, no, we don't want the- Oh, the whole thing's in water? Yeah, you flooded your base. Ooh! How do I- how do I repair it? Well, maybe there's something that you can craft. Well, Why are you getting back in the Seamoth? I don't know. I didn't want to. <laughs> systems online. 42 weak parts? 43 weak parts? Build reinforcements. Okay. Ah! Um, reinforcement? Lithium and titanium. Oh my god, this is, this is the worst thing that's ever happened. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's, let's do this. At least the plants are getting a lot of nutrition. Okay, so we need. Wait, that's lead. Lithium and titan titanium. Reinforcement. The 
that do it? Yes. Now you're back in the plus. Total 4.5. So how do I make the it stop flooding? Well, you need some sort of tool to repair the holes in the walls. Ah. Okay. Well, this is fun. Keep an eye on your oxygen as well. No. Repairing everything. Having a lovely day. <laughs> You're having a lovely day? Yeah. Is that your little songs? Yeah. Oh, I need to drink some water. Where could I find some of that? I could have told you to put that reinforced panel on before you did this, but I thought this would be fine. <laughs> I mean, I assumed that was going to happen at some point, but I wasn't sure at which point it would be an issue. Oh god. Can I, like, leave through here now? Yeah. Okay, there were cool. still a few ruptured patches in the moon pool. Yeah. Oxygen. Unfortunately, breathing was more warning emergency power only. Yes. What? Oh, water. Vital signs stabilizing. Oh, look at the light there. That's... So there's space to get in and out of there, but warning. you can only come in from emergency one angle. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Swimming. If this was like all the game, I'd be okay with that. This like water. Am I upside down? No. Oh. <laughs> oh! Oh! Bless me. I'm so sorry. I didn't have time to do that. Oh, it's energy charging. Yes. It drains oh. power out of the base now. Oh. That's why I told you to build this, so you don't have to keep crafting power. Yeah, cells. that's cool. And I can repair this? Yeah, you got to aim at like the right bit of it, though. It's kind of... Fit. Oh, almost had it. <laughs> Access upgrades. It's tech. Yay! Well, you don't have to. No. And your base is drained of water now, so. That's cool. Oh, I don't get how this works. But there's ladders on either end. Of the oh. No, I mean I don't get how this works. That like there's water underneath. It's full of pressurized air. Oh. Which oh, and I can just walk means it there. keeps the water at a particular level. Yeah. Might want to add more power production to the base. Yeah, yeah probably. I might do that. That's a good idea. Oh, I guess there's still... It's not quite done. Yeah. Um, yeah, it will drain power out of the the base battery. What? It... Sorry? Oh, the water drained down. Okay. Yeah, it Sorry. was draining. Mm. Yeah, the ship will drain the power of the base, but it, it costs a lot of power to refill the seam off. All right. So one solar... Like, you actually ran out of, uh... You ran out of power after you parked the ship there. Okay. So I need another solar panel. And any quartz and copper, which I don't have. I don't have copper, so... The moon pool also has a lot of open space on top of it for solar panels, so... Ah, oh, that helps. Oh, this is so nice. Hmm. All right, so next up, we just need to grab a lot of copper. Do you not have any in the base? No, I've actually run out. No. Because every time I want to get some stuff, you're like, no, I don't need that. Don't get any stuff for the nest. Is that what I sound like? Yeah. It's like Smeagol. Yeah. Stan wants you to play this game properly. Say that. But yeah, a scanner room would help with you finding like 
you know, silver. Copper, yeah, yeah, like materials. Mm. Yeah, I found a bunch of copper before dying, but lost it in the wreck I drowned in. Does that mean that it's still there in the wreck? What is? The copper, like all the stuff that I dropped when I no, drowned. No, I think you just lose. Ooh. Well, I don't know. No, it, it persists. persists. Oh, right, yeah, well, summon the rat then. That's cool. I like how all, all the stuff I dropped, the acid mushroom just stays good. Nice! 30 seconds. Oh. A little bit more bold with getting near these creatures anyway, now that I know I can escape them. What I need to work on, I think, is more water. You picked up a bunch of salt. Yeah, I need salt and something else, right? Coral tube samples. Coral tube samples. I think that's tubes, what I need more. Like right there, right next yeah. to me. Let's just stock up on water. You don't need to click so quickly. It's more like it, but your inventory is full. Huh. So yeah, you've got space to get in and out here as long as you go in from the one direction. Welcome mm. to That's cool. How do I get out? Oh, there. These are just really useful so that you don't have to keep on crafting power cells. Hmm. Yes, I can see that. Hmm. Open locker. Oh, I actually had a bunch of those. Mm -hmm. All your acid mushrooms go in there as well, don't they? Yeah. I wanted to make some glass. Oh no, I've got a bunch of glass, so I might keep that. You wanted to grab the salt? Yes. Yes, I did. You can use that glass to put in windows. That's right. And there was something else that I wanted glass for as well. Oops. Oh, no titanium. I need to work on that. Mm. You've also got those two enzyme things that you don't know what they are. Enzymes? Yeah. They're just taking up space. Should I keep them? No. <laughs> you don't know what they are, so you can just put them in a box. Alright. Until you need them. I suppose. Yes. The fragments are somewhat randomized as well in terms of how they get spawned. Okay. Ah, so much bleach. Yes. Mass mm. production of water. Yes. Good, 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 good. I like the base building in this game. Mmm. Yeah, I noticed. Every time I come back to the base, oh, what can you do now? I'm gonna start taking this impression to heart, I think. Yeah? Oh, what can you do now? I'm strong. <laughs> That's a really good impression! Of me. <laughs> You don't have to do an impression of me. I always sound like me. <laughs> and yet. What are you looking for? Aquarium. Well, that would be a really good wall for a window. Wouldn't it? Yeah, it would. Let's put this aquarium. You've also got all of the upstairs. It's true, but this is where all my food's going. Ah, I see. Oh god, this takes up a lot of space, huh? Oh, ah! Whoa! That's a sick fluid intake. Yeah, Will, just like, give me a break. I'm just cheap. <laughs> Kev, you can go close to the wall and then just aim down to bring it in. 
you know, you'd think. What are you doing? I want to put it up. Yeah. But you can do it. You don't have to walk around. You can do it just by looking. Yeah, well. <laughs> Yay. Oh, oh I'm going to eat you one day. <laughs> it winked at you. Mm. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your walk. Look, look. Why are you eating from this? Oh. <laughs> I should have like a storage thing for spare food. You gotta put at least one window in here. It's very claustrophobic. Ah, uh, fine. For you, I'll put in a bloody window. I'm getting antsy. You're getting Nancy. There you go. Look at that! Isn't that a lovely view? That's a wonderful oh. view. Oh, look what Sean got us to make. Oh, oh. Look at that. You can see the wreckage there. You know, maybe a bit higher would actually make more sense. Just make, make You're going to put the window upstairs. Yeah. And here, I'm going to put a laka for foods. Oh, wait. I don't have enough. Did I take all the titanium? Yeah, it did. Damn. You had two titanium boxes. There was another one. Did you empty it? Yeah. Yeah, that's. this is my backup titanium. Uh, there was a time, Sean, when I had many at my disposal. You could put the window behind the fish prison, remind them of what they've lost. <laughs> that might be funny, actually. I like to build bases within view of the Leviathan. You can look out at them through the window. I can't see the Leviathan. Like, wh what is it? Where do I...? Well, a Leviathan's just any big creature. Oh. What? Go there, man. Boo! Okay, well. Bugger on that. You could go upstairs and it might have a better view. Oh my god. Out of you one of them. Really, the... really want me to build a window, don't you? Yeah, they're cool. Uh, you don't want to spend the whole time in the game inside this box. I do. It's, it makes me feel safe. There you go, that's the better view, isn't it? This can be like a giant observatory. You could also build an observatory for that. I could. Yeah, that, but I could make this a giant observatory. <laughs> the little glass balls are uh, good for little observatory rooms. Or if you want a big one. <laughs> Cav is a fellow window hater. Be still my beating heart. Yes, no, I'm, I'm not, I mean... They're all right, but I mean, I just associate them with letting, um... Not how you can look in as well from the outside. What? Yeah, look at my big empty house. Yeah. <laughs> uh... ah! <laughs> 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 oh, that was awkward. Oh, I want you. <laughs> I'm always trying to get inside. Yeah, I'll show you. I'll show you what it's like. Let me show you my house. You also got a vehicle upgrade station you could make inside the... Yes. Yeah, remember. Showing the fish my house. You see? <laughs> Look, and I'll take you... I'll show this you... Introduce creepy. you to your new friend. This is like serial killer shit. Okay? That's where you came from. And... This is where you're gonna stay until I eat you. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Your little little friend there. Yeah, nice and happy. Until I'm hungry. Mm. <laughs> Clumsy fart manatee.
Where's my bin? Got rid of the bin. <laughs> that thing's just standing there. Uh, okay, well, let's put those in until I figure out what they're good for. And then I wanted to build a locker here and put all my snacks and stuff, but can I just like drop them? No, I can't. What snacks? I need titanium. Need extra water. Yeah. Well, that seems good for now. Then I'll stock up on titanium. Can't have the colonial imprisoning the natives. Uh, well, I am part white, so. Okay, so. Fully charged. And, and away we go. Immediately damage my ship. This is how we do it. So you know stalkers collect that and put it in the little patches. Oh there. yeah, because I wanted titanium. <laughs> Ooh! Oh fuck off! I wanted to see if it would do damage and yes it did. Stop picking it up, putting it back down again. Just give me a chance. Stop it! I mean, it's very, very endearing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just opened my mouth to start saying, you've gotten a lot more bra braver at playing this game. <laughs> yeah, well. Oh, what's this? Titanium is what it is. I'm starting to get, not brave, but bold, I think is what you could say. Foolhardy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh! Okay, oh, it's so dark. Oh, something else down there. Sea glide. Or titanium, as we hear in the more technologically you took the seam advanced off. community nerd. The, what? You took the seam off out of the base and then abandoned it immediately and just <laughs> swimming around without it. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> Fine, I'll just back in. If that makes me happier. It won't. You've never been happy, I know. Oh, it's got nothing in. <laughs> Be careful, your face is like a punching distance. Uh -huh. Why are you trying to find titanium? Oh, my boat! Because I want to make a... Oh. Shit. Oh, I wanted to replenish my collection! Because it was my collection. I want to scream compilation made by someone at the end of this playthrough, by the way. That would be so shrill and annoying. It would be really shrill and really annoying. But you would watch it. Yeah, I would watch it. <laughs> hey, look at that, Kev. Turn around. Look down. <laughs> Not the little tiny fish. I meant that there was a big hop hole. There's a big cave. You can go down. <laughs> you shouldn't do that when you know there are... I didn't know there was a tiny fish behind you you were going to scream at. Did I? Whoa! <laughs> it's like, oh, that's a giant eye? Oh no, the, the, it's those. It's those. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, I'm tense. I'm going to sit away from here. I, I'd like to alert you to the crush depth of the sea moth. Can you see that on the screen? Hmm. Up to get me. 
Well, I'm going to have to swim down, aren't I? I don't want to. I'm going to go as far as I can. I don't like that they look like eyes! What you could do is leave a beacon here. Warning. Maximum you're, death you're, you're crushing. You need to back up. Imminent. The conditions in this gave support a microcosm of unique, possibly predatory life force. Oh. Detecting an artificial structure somewhere in the region. Possibly predatory? A multitude? You want to back up about 10 meters. No, that's, that's, that, no, that's making you go forward. You want to back up about 10 meters, yeah. What is that? Oh, shit. Oh, you can just hover here and look around. Again, you've only looked in one direction. Uh... Oh, look at the eels! I mean, you were saying that if I wanted to, and I don't, I could get out of the ship here and then put on the rebreather. And then you could swim down. Hmm. If you wanted to explore that place. Could you? Please? Oh, you want me to do it? Yes. I mean, I could do it. Yes, please. Okay. You don't really have very much food. Can I eat your nutrient block? Oh, sure. I was just there for emergencies, but whatever. It was well, kind of an emergency, is an emergency, isn't it? And you've got a beacon as well. Should we put that down so that you can find this place again? <laughs> Cute, eh? What should we call this? Little friend. You can't call them all little friend. It's the name of where it is. Yeah. There you go. Now you'll have to remember that little friend means this place. Of course. How could I forget? Yeah, it does seem strange how the diver can go beyond the vehicle. You can go into those pod things, can you? Ooh. Nice. What? So, water filtration machine. <gasps> yes. That seems like it might be beneficial. Oh my god. Yes, please. And what's in the in the house? Oh. Can we get off the air before I go? Yeah. This is so cool. We will never have to use we use like other fish to get water again, presumably, or scavenge for ingredients like peasants. You're not going to go back into the ship. Oh, Marguerite! She's the the person who was in the island. Mm. It's a great new PDA data. Oh. It's very pretty. It is, isn't it? Ultra high capacity tank. Ooh. And a bed. Basic double bed. Now you can sleep through the nights. Oh, it's a shame I'll never be able to sleep with someone. Because everyone's dead. <laughs> And I'm alone. Yeah, how bad for you. <laughs> you can see voice slow number six mm -hmm. deeper? <laughs> okay, so we can go up here. 
seen any predatory things. Unless by predatory they meant can sting you. That's them. Oh. Well, at least they're not near the ship. Whoa! Oh, okay. So they live in the, in the holes. Like those things. They live in there. Is that right? They live in the jellyfish. They live in the jellyfish, yes. Oh. So there can be ones inside the jellyfish. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. I feel a little tense. <laughs> oh, did you get everything that you could get from there? I think so. Hmm. Here you go. Yay! Thank you! I can make some more shit, but I do need to go out for ingredients at some point, I think. Oh, well, let's, uh, let's get some of these then, shall we? Oh, silver. You need silver to make wire mesh things. There was a scannable thing over there as well. Was there? Well, go back to the ship. Oh, hang on, you just looked at it. <laughs> See, when I say there's something, you start going, ah! Ah, like that, like, over there. What's that? <laughs> Is that my ship? No, it looks like a Seamoth fragment. <laughs> you just start pivoting around wildly and look away from whatever it is I was trying to get to. What the? What are you doing? Well, you're mine now. Getting caught. Oh, I'm going to fill my aquarium full of all sorts of creatures. There's a new type up there. Have you got one of them? Uh -huh. Those tiny little things. These? No, the little purple ones. These ones? No, the little purple ones. Turn around. Okay. There, little purple. Oh. Reginald! That one seems like a bitey. New creature discovered. So, the PDA is naming these things, isn't it? it they seems... don't have names. Yeah. Oxygen. Where's my... Oh. Hmm. I was thinking about that. Like, it's... The, the other log said the computer gave it the designation. Mm -hmm. Welcome aboard, Captain. Don't forget to check out all the new logs. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. new logs. I should probably go back to base, but I really want to find a scanner. You can just keep looking around. So the scanning room fragments, we did find that in the red zone, didn't we, chat? Yeah. Uh, oh, well, you asked the chat, not me. Hmm. They've uh -oh. got a bit of memory than me. Oh! Birdie, thanks for hosting! Did I just get attacked? Or yeah. ah! Okay, that's it. I'm going yes. back. <laughs> but look, you're fine. It just bumped into you. Mm. You can keep looking around. You're fine. Robot Ghost says, I'm so proud of you, Cab. That was the longest one yet. Oh, I was not built for this game. I'm so glad that you're here. Otherwise, this would not this game would not be still going on. I should have made you swim down into the cave, shouldn't I? No. <laughs> it's not how this works. We had a deal. Yes. Well, yeah, you can build a bed now, and uh, the bed will let you skip nights. So. Yay! Welcome aboard, Captain. Hooray! So you should probably face the ship. You don't have to go into the water to do it. It's actually harder to do that. 
Oh, is it? Huh. Yeah. Okay. You just gotta aim at the right part. Of it. So. Stop. Stop it. Oh god, you're annoying. part. Oh, the bed is also useful for getting batteries to charge or plants to grow quickly. That's that's a really interesting idea. You said I didn't have to go into the water. You don't. Huh? What? What did I do? Is the ship still? Oh. Oh, it's right there. Okay, I was on the wrong side. Thank, thank you for that. I appreciate you. Carry on. You've got some lugs to read. I'm about to build. Yes. Ooh, what's that then? Modification station. Nice. We can do that to become faster. Power cell charger. Eh. You got one power cell. Those. Basic double bed. There was actually yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh, aerogel. Yeah. Bioreactor. Fiber mesh. What's that? A bench. <laughs> Conserves energy when resting. Can I use that instead of a bed? No, you're, when you're sitting down, mm. you like won't. Your bars won't drain, I think is what that means. Oh, so I can sit down and read, listen to the PDA stuff. I think so, yeah. Okay, that's cool. If you make the vehicle modification station, you can do the most important thing in the game. Can you make it honk? Hi. Well, oh, thanks for following, nameless mid boss. Um, building that modification station will allow you to put upgrades in the CMO. Ah, yes. Reginald. High calorie count. Look at all these! Oh. oh, look at that little one, Reginald. Reginald is not long for this world. Look at that. Can't even swim around. There's something more important than upgrades. Oh, yeah, of course. There's something more important than upgrades? I bet they will bully Reginald. <laughs> Most likely, yes. I have enough silver to make another wire um, thing. Don't spend it yet until you know that you need to. Okay. Nice. Well, this has been a successful uh, scavenging mission. What can I? What can I make? Well, the modification station is a base part that you build with the base builder. It's a... Uh, you, you don't build it in this. I'm not looking for that, I'm just looking to see if there's anything else. Oh, right, well you asked what you could build and that was the last thing we talked about that you could build. Oh, I see. So I assume that's what you're asking about. I wanted mesh, fiber mesh. Oh. I didn't realize that actually had a use. A first aid kit. Ah, that's interesting. Rebreather. Compass. The HUD is like... The heads-up display, that's all of the things that you can see. Oh, okay, so that is actually useful. If you have directions. Like one of the life pod directions says 400 meters northwest of somewhere else. 
way. Okay. So you could go there and then nowhere northwest. And possibly. it might also help me orient myself a little bit more. Yeah. So that's cool. Scanner, repair tool, flashlight, survival knife, pathfinder tool, air, bladder, flare, habitat builder, laser cutter, stasis rifle, I don't have magnetite, propulsion cannon. The propulsion cannon is a, a key build for you right now. Okay, so uh, that that's what I can use my silver for. Yeah. If you build the propulsion cannon, the game doesn't tell you this, but I will just tell you to save your trip because it's a pain in the ass, right? It acts like all you need to get into the big ship is the radiation suit. Hmm. And, but then you get there, and you find out that actually there's some boxes blocking the door, so you need a way to move them. Oh. And you can move them with the propulsion cannon. And there's just no way to know that before you go there. <laughs> it's, just, okay. it's just a pain in the ass. So, if you've... Right. You can also modify your... Uh, your equipment with a modification station, but that's a ways off, I think. Mm. Um, and building the vehicle thing is important, too. The vehicle thing? It'll be in uh, interior modules. Parasol charge modification sp station. Oh, uh, no, actually. Did computer we... chip. Not that one. That's modification of equipment, but you want the moon pole part. It's the vehicle modification station. Yeah, but the modification station uh, will get me a lightweight oxygen tank. Yeah, but that's rubbish. Um, just find out what you need to build the vehicle modification station. How do I find... Oh, I need to go up? Or no, something? you need to look in, look in the, the build menu. Here? Whoa! 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 Let me... Oh. It doesn't matter where you are, you just need to look in the menu and find it. I was going to make a bed, wasn't I? So it doesn't look like it is in there. There it is. Computer chip. So yeah. both of them I need a computer chip and I want this one. I want error gel. <laughs> uh, so yeah, the modification station is really important. Okay, so what was it that I need for that? This, right? Computer chip. So I've got two things that require a computer chip I need to look into. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have the ultra tank blueprint too. And a knife that auto cooks fish? Oh, that's good. I like that. So I need to pick up some... Wait, where'd the mesh go? How do you make mesh? I believe it's out of quick finds. Ah, uh, okay. So I'll need to go hunting for that. And I also need to look at what is required for... a computer chip. <clears throat> Whoa, look at all that. Ah, oh. oh, prawn suit! Yes! I want a prawn suit. You should be excited about those two things. Eh. <laughs> Not really. No. No. Computer chip. But you can... You, you don't care about making the hull of the Seamoth? more powerful and the ability to scare away enemies. Oh, yes. You don't feel like that would be important. Yeah, it might be. <laughs> Table, coral, copper, wire, gold. So I need copper, which I'm missing. No, I've got... What was it? It was gold. Copper wire. Oh, I need more copper. God damn it. In the computer chip, I need table coral and copper wire. So, table coral. Oh, crap. oh I'm also low on table coral. Ooh, I need to get some supplies. I need fiber mesh. I want, scan I want Cav to scan a reaper without Sean's help. No, that's not going to happen. Yeah, sure. No. Okay. 
we have heard a reaper once, but that's as close as, we, as we've been to one. Yeah. And I was too clever to go any closer, even though I didn't recognize that it was a scary sound. Yeah, you didn't notice what the sound was. So, what was it? And I needed copper. If you make the bed, you can sleep through the night and then explore in the day. Oh yeah, yes, let's do that. First things first. We'll make the bed. You have been going for more than three hours now, Captain. Have we? Yeah. Oh, nice! Okay, well why don't we make the bed and make the upgrade station um, and then call it a, a day? It sounds like a good idea. I'm, uh... We should probably Following uh, Jordan Peterson's advice and uh, making my own bed. I never could have gotten that information from any anywhere else. I'm really glad that he wrote a book about it. Leave Jordan Peterson alone. Yeah? Yeah. Alright. That's what I say. How many do I need to make a bed? Titanium 2. Yay! I think I'll make the bed upstairs. I'll finally start work on uh, these will be my sleeping quarters right next to the window so I can wake up and have like a giant fish in my face. I think that would be really relaxing. <laughs> living the dream. Yeah. Living the nightmare. You gonna put it sideways like that? Yeah. Mm, that's fine, you know. Just kind of jutting out into the room, innit? Where should I put it? Right in the middle here? No, like, you know, up against the wall. Is it not up against the wall? I mean, it's fine either way. Do it like you like it. I, just, I sympathize with Peterson, because I too once drank a cider. And it ruined my life. Seek fluid intake. Oh. Yeah, um... And, uh... Wait, sorry, I was thinking of the wrong person. I was thinking of that men's rights activist who, uh, whose origin story was that was refusing to take his his diarrhea medication. Don't know that one. Uh, Paul Elam, one of the, the the founder of A Voice for Men. Oh, I've never heard of that before, but it would be nice for men to finally have a voice. Yeah, right. Yeah. Been silence. They've been quiet for so long, you just never hear men talking about anything. And the moment they do, they're just censored immediately. They're just carried off field. Then quietly shot in the night. That's perfect, you're not getting it than that. Someone needs to speak out against big diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> Talk Dibris says, I'm literally not talking right now. Ignore my name. Oh, maybe. Okay, now. Oh. oh, you know what? I just had a mean thought. You had a mean thought? Yeah. I want to put this poster uh, in a place where the fish will see it, so they'll just be reminded of why they're in this you situation. You might be able to hang it right behind the tank, if you can aim up above it. What the? Oh, okay. No, I guess not. Dang. What's is this on the opposite? I'll put it here, and that's like the opposite wall. I mean, the trees are in the way. It's okay. Yeah. A 
I don't think the fish got the point. Yeah. Vital signs stabilizing. The melons are pretty good, aren't they? Yeah. And then, uh. This planter. It's a good job that the melons are good because you don't have any more potatoes. Mm hmm. Damn straight. Okay, so I guess I'll store away. your creep vines. Yeah. Oh. You've got a bunch of logs you can read as well. That's true. The logs. Um, and to make a computer chip, I need a copper. I forgot. Oh. Mm hmm. Computer chip, table coral. So I need some more table coral. And I need some more copper. Yeah. And then we can make the vehicle modi modification. Just double thing. check the vehicle modification station recipe. Because it doesn't just take a chip. The hmm? last one. The middle one. There. There it is. Titanium. So you'd three, actually need more copper. Extra. So you need free copper, basically. Okay. But copper wire involves um, two. Two. Okay. You've got one. Yeah. But so you need to go find three copper. Okay, let's do that. So you need one to make the chip and two extra to make the wire. All right. Well, it's light out, so we can do that for sure. Child's play. You can swim back to the floating island to get more, you know. More of what? Oh, the plants. Yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah, the plants. It's all right. The melons are pretty good, aren't they? Oh, what is that? Yeah, the melons seem to be doing it for us. Get some more titanium as well. But it's copper we want, isn't it? You can find copper in caves, right? You can find copper in any limestone nodes like that one. So you need to be on the lookout for limestone nodes. Okay. Which generally spawn on walls and mm. in caves. Okay. <laughs> oh. You went past one. Did I? Where? Oh. Copper. That's one. That's no. Didn't pick up one of us. Copper. Nice. You only need one more. Grabbing this quartz is probably a good idea too. You always need quartz. I feel like I should get more copper than I need. Seconds. You need to go to the surface. Wee! Yeah, I find you're it hard also... to see with the hologram up. Yeah, me too. Can you get rid of the hologram? If you yes, you can. Really? Yeah. There's one. He's one last one. so much for streaming with me by the way. I know it's your stream day today. It's alright. So it's a lot one. of streaming. I like streaming. And a lot of screaming. You got all the copy you need to make the station. I know. I know. So, so I'll make a, I'll get a few more. So I have some extra. Well, I mean you could sort of prioritize the scan room. The scan room? Yeah, you could prioritize finding the rest of the scan Oh, room yes, pieces. I think I will, definitely. 30 seconds. Mm. Uh, 
uh, because if you do that, then you won't have to go around hunting. You can just tell it to search for limestone or sandstone notes. Right. Ten seconds. Oxygen. Okay, yay! Still, there's an element of 3D movement in this game which is messing you up. Not quite as badly as, uh, as in Outer Wilds, world, but in this is as well. Alright, I'll slowly make my way back. Then we'll listen to the, to the logs. And make the vehicle thing. And call it a night. It's an afternoon. Good. Go via the bottom in case we see any more cool stuff in the way. Captors 3D orientation probably. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You can. Your problem was keeping a sort of mindset that was relative to whatever was the last planet you left instead of relative to the movement of the ship, I felt. Yeah? Yeah. You've been analyzing it since the stream, have you? Yeah. <laughs> And also a tendency to think in, like, sense of uh, air resistance, and like not, you know, accounting for the fact that Welcome in space, aboard, if you Captain. stop accelerating, you don't screech to a halt. You just keep going. You might, though. Know. I need copper wire. Yes, titanium. Like swimming at a 45 degree angle rather than an 80. Mm. Well, yeah, like if you want to get up quickly and you're holding this, you should aim yourself at the surface and press forward because then the sea glide will pull you up. What you're doing is holding space, so you're swimming up holding the sea glide. Computer chip, table, ah, I forgot about the table coral. I need one more table coral. Table coral, table coral, what do you do with some, okay, oh, here it is. Oh, we'll never hear the rest of that song. <laughs> you sad. And that, no, you know where it is, it's right next to the base. Yes, yes, more! It. I'm not wasting it, it's all gonna go to good use. I need to make another solar panel as well, don't I? And I need gold as well, yeah? It hasn't been so bad so far. You don't have anything that is continuously draining the power. Um, Except for my ship. If you get, for instance, that doesn't continuously drain it. That just drains it till its battery is full. Mm. Um, a water filtration machine is a big power draw, though. Let's see. That will filter water for you, but it really eats the power, so... Uh, what was I gonna get? I wanted to make wall locker for excess food. Pretty much, not much food doesn't uh, deteriorate, so you want to be eating most of it straight away. Mm. I'm not sure you will have excess food. It's more like water and things, yeah. like extra bottles of water. Ah, I see. Don't you have some of those in the titanium box you can move over? Yes. I need to run to the bathroom. 
Oh, God. So inconvenient. Things. Thongs. And I'll put in this extra computer chip in there. Now what did I... Oh, I was trying to make... A... Machine thing. Right? Oh, I might actually need some more copper. Because... Um, to make that station... The upgrade... Thing. Where is it? Where's it gone? Fire extinguisher, creature decoy. Oh, probably would be among here, right? Vehicle upgrade console. Okay, I need copper wire. Did I not make another one of those? Let's have a look. I may have used extra copper unnecessarily. I think I did. Let's find out. This will be a moment of shame. Me getting ahead of myself. Yeah, I need to get one more copper shot. Why? Because I made two computer chips instead of one because I remembered there was some other, I think, another modification. So you don't have enough for a copper wire now? Yeah. Can't have. What are you doing? I know. But we established that. <sighs> Shut up. The flashlight might be. In fact, sleeping might be. As well. I just want one copper. Would you like me to find you a copper? Yes. If you build the vehicle station really quickly, you can do something that will annoy Sean when he comes back. Oh. Too slow. <laughs> ah, there, there was one back there. Oh yeah. Yeah. Good spot. Unfortunately, it was a titanium. You'll get to the point where you'll have broken most of the nodes around your base. Oh really, they don't respawn? I don't know if they do. They must do. There's like a bunch of like... Yay! They do eventually. Oh, right. Nice. So you can use this as a, this base. Is that as a what? Well, you don't have an icon for your base, but you can use the, the life pod as. Oh! Well, because it's close to it, you know. Yeah. Are you gonna make the copper wire so I don't get distracted and make something else? I wasn't going to, but I could. <laughs> make the station here? It's, it can go against one of these walls. Like all these walls you can put either like a window on or you could put a reinforced thing or you can put this. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Seamoth docked fully charged. Oh that's so cool! Base? Name. No. That's so rude. Oh, it's that rude. Oh, it's so gonna be dark. So there's a color slider on the right as well. 
that makes it more garish. Mm-hmm. God, so cool. All right, and yeah. I can't remember if I had mine hot pink or if I made them look like a bumblebee. Oh, a bumblebee! Oh! So is that all that I do? Well, in base, with the base colour, and then you can also change the slider on the right. See? So you can have it be any colour you like. <laughs> Gamergate colours. You had them hot pink. Oh, right. That's the, those are the colors I used to have for my... That looks like vomit. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh, it's ugly. <laughs> it is, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Oh yeah, no one will suspect me. Is that all that I do here? No, there's okay. another aspect to this. Yes, tell so me. turn around. Oh, ooh, bronze suit. So that's for me. The bronze suit is a different type of vehicle that you don't have access to for quite a while. Okay. Save. Oh, that's good. That's good for us, right? Yeah, that'll mean that you can go down into deeper areas. And we can do that, like, we can do that one now. Yes, oh, but we don't have po polyaniline. Yeah, I don't know how you make that either. Fire torpedoes! <laughs> oh. Hull reinforcement. So you could make that. I think you've got the floor diamond. Mm, I think so too. Engine efficiency module. Heat byproduct to minimize power inefficiencies. We don't have storage. <gasps> a small storage locker? Yes. Yep. Okay. So you could put on like a storage locker and increase the strength of the hull. Yeah. I would really recommend increasing the strength of the hull. Okay, so we need titanium, lithium, diamond. And we need that as, for that as well. Mm. And we need ingot and glass. God, it's so ugly. Yeah. But if you increase the hull strength, then, like, if things bite you, it will, won't do as much damage. Nice. And if something very big. Uh, I've only got three diamond. Oh, well, you'd need to get another diamond then, wouldn't you? But that can be a problem for next time because you know where they spawn. Yeah, it was it was titanium and lithium that I needed for the other things, right? Yes, I believe so. But it was like two of each. <laughs> um, yeah, so you know that there were diamonds on that island that you went to. Mm. Okay, so I can't make that, but I can make What's that. What's the uh, solar? And ingot I need. Solar? Uh, Advanced wiring kit and enamel glass. You can make that as well, if you wanted to. And that way, it, the power wouldn't drain when you're in sunlight. Don't really care about it. I mean, it doesn't really matter, honestly. Mm. There aren't many times when this will be running out of power. The defensive options are more important. What are you looking for? I want to get rid of some of this extra stuff. Just put it in there then. No. <laughs> Oops. I guess I'll just You've got an egg box. Yeah, I do. <laughs> you got a box specifically for eggs. And then this is where I'll just put this stuff for the time being. It won't. It's full. Well, I put it in the wrong... I was meant to put it in the other one. 
Well, I'll take it back then. I will. I take it all back. Oh, I guess this isn't. It doesn't matter where you put it. It does. <laughs> I have a system. What are you doing? You're just swapping first aid kits in and out of that box over and over. I keep... Ah! I wanted to put that in there genuinely. Get rid of those fungal samples. There's no reason to carry them. How back. do I get rid of it though? I need put a garbage them. bin. No, put them in the box. There. Why are you carrying them around? You don't know what they do. Because I hate you. That is... Oh my god. I'm getting panicky now. <laughs> You should. <laughs> You're being surly at me. You should probably keep one on you, shouldn't you? In case you get hurt. Mm -hmm. Okay, so get another thing, ingot thing. Ingot. Thing got. Ingot, ingot. Stop being a butcher. <laughs> <laughs> Carrying random fungus in your pockets. Oh, there's something that I can make here that I haven't made before. Plastealing it. Okay. That's more complicated construction material for other stuff. Hmm. Oh wait, no, we did need this. I love the little broken science machine on the floor. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. Oh, I was quoting Rufin. Oh no, wait, Robot Ghost in the chat. Oh, you don't actually like it. No, I find it irritating. <laughs> yes. Seems more accurate. Yay! Yeah. And oh, so you can make another one? Well, you should look at the upgrade panel on the ship to find out. Okay, let's have a look at the upgrade panel. Oh, on this disgusting no, ship. No, uh, on, on the outside. Oh. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems Ooh, online. free fish! God, I'm doing so much damage Welcome to this aboard, ship. Captain. Come oh. to me, little bit. Oh, I'm just distracted on the way to the ship. Uh, okay. Ooh, another one. Come back. We will be we'll good eating. Yes, you will be good eating. Mm, nom, nom, nom. So, what do I need to do? Go to the ship. Look at it. Access upgrades. You yeah. So you've got four upgrade slots. Some upgrades will stack. Some won't. Oh. Right, so now it can go up to 300 meters, and it has a little pod on the side that you can put stuff in. Seek fluid intake. Nice. Oh, I don't have any water here. You've got lots of water here. I mean, like, but like in my stuff. Oh, but you got some in the other room. I do. So yeah, priority for next time would be uh, getting the... Vital signs stabilizing. Oh, take a look at how you make po polyaniline here as well. Pony polyaniline. Yeah, it'll be somewhere in here. Sean has never liked a single thing. I like some things. Have you seen that it has the ship's name on the hull? Stop cooking them all. You don't need to eat that many fish. This is what you got the aquarium for. Oh yeah. Gonna put the cooked ones in. Yeah. Oh, just just wasted waste. one. Yeah. Mm. But go and look at what it takes to make polyaniline. Okay. What is it? I don't know. <laughs> I want to know. I didn't see anything listed there. Yeah, it's not there. Mm. Well, that's a mystery. Mm. It's time then, isn't it? Yeah. How exciting. Okay, so we're taking a trip back to the island tomorrow. 
that's yeah. going to be our first goal, is, I guess. And I would, yeah, I would recommend getting the upgrade, definitely, for the the hull thing. Yes, the incredible hull. It will make the ship a lot more survivable. Is there anything else I was going to do before I quit? You were going to listen to the logs. Oh yeah. From the cave. All right, let's 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 do this then. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. I've got stuff to do today before I stream. I'm sorry. I'm going for four hours now. I'm sorry. I... Oh, and we got a radio broadcast. This is going to take forever. Yay! Hurry up. I thought it might get claustrophobic living underwater. <laughs> Father feels it is. Yes, shut up. He'd tell me it was childish, but I stare out the window and sometimes I think how lucky I am to see this world up close. Back on the island, I wouldn't have believed the creatures that live down here. The fish, they glow. There's one that's 90% eyeball. Snakes twice the length of a habitat compartment. Yeah. Certainly, it's not all friendly. Most of the plant life is toxic. I learned that the hard way. But I've managed to coax some marble melons into growing indoors. And when they don't cover our dietary needs, well, we eat the fish themselves. It's a bit gross, but it's nothing they wouldn't do. I've been attempting to document my findings. Father approves. He says understanding is power. That the more we know about this planet, the more we can use it to our advantage. I'm just doing it because it's fun. It's not easy without proper equipment and yeah, network access. Nice, eh? But the old-fashioned way, observing, taking notes, testing theories, shows me the world in a way a spectroscopic analysis never could. Lately, I've been watching the crab snakes. They ambush their prey as it tries to feed on the mushrooms they hide in. What they don't eat settles on the seabed, which fertilizes the mushrooms, which feeds the herbivores, and so the chain continues. Co-evolution gives me the fuzzies. Yay! Ambushed prey. Something incredible just happened. Since we're down here, I had this plan to build equipment and study the life forms we were encountering, but I didn't have enough enameled glass. So. I started looking for a natural substrate that would strengthen the glass we have. And those stalker teeth we've been finding fit the bill. Only, well, we needed more. That's when Marguerite got interested. She actually listened to me. More than I can say for father. And I worked up the courage to talk about my more tentative theories. When I told her they were attracted to metal deposits, that their teeth get dislodged when they pick them up, her eyes narrowed and she dashed out of the room. Three hours later, she came back, her pack loaded down with stalker teeth. I asked her about it. She shrugged and said my theories were good. Said she had the meeting out of the palm of her hand. I think she meant it literally. Hmm. She is incredible. She went out to the kelp forest armed with just a heat blade and heat went fin blade. to fin with a pack of stalkers. On the one hand, that is the coolest thing I have ever heard. On the other... Well, I hope the stalkers didn't come off worse than Marguerite did. She had a huge gash on her forearm. I don't think things went as smoothly as she made out. And what's the point in surviving here if we have to kill everything that makes it so wonderful? Mm -hmm. I wish I knew more about these animals. But Father won't let me leave the habitat. Maybe with all this glass, we could build a containment unit and get up close to them. Okay, so it's good, probably going to be from... from... Bart that we get this containment unit stuff because he's the one who's into studying the animals. Maybe there was a containment unit that I forgot to scan down there. <laughs> I can't remember. Let's find out next time, eh? There's more. Well, you've learned those. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We're already 200 meters below sea level. You want to go deeper? Look around us, chief. Water leaking through the hull, water outside the hatch. We're drowning real slow. If rescue arrives, whatever shot us down, it's going to do it again and again until it shut uh -huh. off. You see an off switch around here, Chief? 
Why would any more likely be half a kilometer down? Your kid found something on the scanner. There's something down there. Something that shouldn't be. <laughs> You're mm. mad! I'm going all the same, and I have an idea you two are gonna follow. But if you do, be mindful. Your authority stopped at sea level. Hmm. All right. These conniving corporate bourgeois, inbred, incompetent, self-absorbed jerks don't have a damn clue. The kid's not so bad. He's even useful. But I swear, everything that comes out of his father's idiot face is a narcissistic lie. He wants to stay in this cave. His problem. I'm the one doing the heavy lifting. When sea monsters are hunting you, you don't hide. You hunt the Easy. sea monsters. Then you build a bigger boat out of sea monster bones and you hunt bigger monsters. Keep going until there aren't any monsters left to hunt you. I'm going deeper. I'm gonna find what shot us down and I'm gonna tear its damn heart out. I started the prep work. The kids taught me how to make enameled glass. I've started stockpiling metal ores to build myself a sea moth. I'll raid the indoor grow beds before I leave. Okay, so enameled glass is apparently really important for something. And I do have all these teeth. Yeah, you make them out of stalker teeth. And you have stalker teeth, mm. which is good. I'm so glad I collect so many things, even if I don't think that they're necessary. Well, you accidentally picked up most of them while trying to grab titanium, but That's we're sure we'll give you this one. Well done. Kat. I did also <laughs> collect some on purpose. <laughs> in my defense. Yeah, oh wait, there's also a radio <laughs> yeah. radio breaker. This is life pod 7. Coordinates attached. Pod is structurally sound, but the fabricators bust. Requesting assistance. 7 out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to back. Hmm? Don't you want to look at where that was? You don't yeah. want to? No, you... Oh, Dada Bank. Yeah. <laughs> Did that just bounce off you, Kev? That one? I didn't understand what that meant. There you go. Oh. I feel like I've seen that before. Low ecological activity. Yay! One kilometer southwest of the Aurora's stern section. Mm hmm. Where could that be? I would say that it is... About one kilometer southwest of the Aurora stern section. Yeah. Oh. We well, need a, a compass to find out which way is which. <gasps> Look at the name of my ship on the side. Yeah, it's great. Hmm? Shame it doesn't have a honk button. Yeah, that, that's what I was assuming that it would oh. be. Um, uh, it would it would have like. Oh well, you should. Probably Yes, I'm going to wrap up here. All right, we are going to save, and then we are going to... Oh, this is the one I was never able to find. This is the what? Oh, the, the, the radio, life the life pod. Yeah. This is when I stopped playing. Oh, well, we're in for a treat. How long have we been playing this game? 10 hours, 12 minutes. This game is really fun, and I'm so glad I have a, a co-pilot to... Um, Snidely backseat, um, but <laughs> it's been good. Thank you all for for joining me this and uh, and Sean today. It was lots and lots of fun again. Um, I probably won't be streaming every day for the next, you know, until I finish it because uh, that's probably not good you for anyone's sanity. Yeah, yeah. But it is really, really fun. I'm enjoying it a lot. And I've been getting cravings for it when I'm not playing it. At least Hi. cravings for the safe parts. Seringer, thanks for following! Um, okay, and I still can't... I've forgotten how to... T <laughs> Sean has been our representative in that in the room. <laughs> oh, you could raid Diana Jack. Let's do that, shall we? Oh, read. Raid. I mean, the moment that you hit it, it's half the stream over, so you don't want to. Really? Well, yeah, so you want to say. No, it normally does a countdown. Okay. Right, yeah. Anyway. Well, you probably want to wrap up before you. Yeah, I mean, I have wrapped up. 
Bye. Bye. <laughs> then I guess that's the end. That's the end. So I'll see you next time, probably 7:30 p.m. GMT on on Tuesday. Although we may do like a weekend stream or something, depending on how we're feeling. Maybe. And um, yeah, let's raid Diana Jack. Ciao, ciao. Very well. I don't have permission to perform that action. Well, you're locked in. There's me, aren't you here? But you're a mod. You should be able to do that, right? No. Really? Yeah, you need to do it. Oh, geez. okay. Sorry. Give Give me one second. I'm gonna do it. Uh, on here, uh, just bear with me. Sean. Uh, take get, entertain the good people while I figure this out. Well, how about we just go to the other scene, we'll say bye on the camera? Yeah, okay, on. let's just bye. We go to that, which is still my scene, but it's set up with your chat now. Okay, and then we're gonna mute ourselves and we'll be back next time. And I will be back later on at my regular stream time, folks. So I'll see you then. Yes. And hang about for a minute after we go because Cav is going to raid Diana Jack. Oh, I'm in flight mode. That's why this hasn't been working. When Cav figures it out. Yeah. See you later, folks. Ciao, ciao. Bye.